what Lady them are doing in LA with the brown bag. Brown bag. Brown bag. Brown bag. Brown bag. This episode is dedicated to Letty. Happy birthday! Letty! Letty! And, 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 and for your birthday, we invited the guy from No Seva. Shut up. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. It no. was already special on no. its own. No, 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 no. no. And, and, and honestly, all Letty <laughs> wants for her birthday is for you guys to go get brown bag tickets for the Novo. <laughs> That's all she wants, That's all brothers she wants. and sisters. Press the link. Yeah. You in can... our description, it comes to you at the brown bag. All right, check this out. I usually am very, like, super, like, hey, you guys, it's four days till my birthday. Hey, you guys, next episode is going to be my birthday episode. And it didn't say anything. And so to walk in here to Flowers, shout out to Brenda's Beauty Flowers. That's shout right. Brenda. Shout out Brenda. And for you guys to be so sweet and nice, it means a lot to me. Of course. Appreciate you. Yeah. And honestly, we on you was this week. We're just debating on what dates. We all had different answers. Are you kidding? But in a good way, it was like, at least we knew the week. Yeah. It's progress. True, true. <laughs> it's progress. It's knowing like it's somewhere in November too. Yeah. It's, hey, it's this yeah. week. No, we're like, it's this week. And then, and then um, I just had to text Jorge to confirm. And he was like. And the I was 23rd. Like, and I was like, gracias, homie. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> And then I told everybody, oh, we good, we good, we good, we good. Yeah, that, and, that's awesome. And you guys knew my favorite color. Purple is my yes, favorite color. Facts. Yes, Shout yeah. out to yeah. your best friend. <laughs> you <Yubi. laughs> No, Angie's not here right now, but she has a big problem with the last episode, me calling you yeah. specifically my best friend. Just because she knows how much I've hated you for so long. Yeah. But then she's like, dude, Letty, you were calling him your best friend. Like, stop it. No, she's like, like uh, she's a, she's being a hater right now. Oh, did I yeah. mention best friend that I got you a something else? What? Yeah, I got Shut you up. something else. Yeah. Shut up, Vic. Nothing crazy, you know, but I just thought of you. you You're know. so <laughs> cute. Right? This is Vic. cool. And, and look. No more drinking out of a Red Bull. You got a Yoshi wow, cup. Wow, Vic. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Vic, it feels amazing being your friend. Right? You should've, feels, we should have been friends a long time ago. <laughs> a long time ago. What did Yoshi do? What did Yoshi do? Mama. Look, look, hold on, wait, look, it's a hand puppet. You're alive. <laughs> I swear to God, stick your finger no. up his ass. Well, yes. Are you fisting Yoshi? <laughs> well, oh. <laughs> clearly I don't use hands, you guys. All right. But, Vic, I even bought product glasses to match your product glasses. Hey. So that's what we're wearing on the podcast now. We're yeah, yeah. besties, dog. Fuck a friendship It's official bracelet. now. Yeah. I love this. Because that means I don't have to be, like, the middle. <laughs> Like, like usually it's like Futaletti and then fucking tell Vic to get yeah. together, and I'm like, oh. okay. How about I called Vic today, like, and usually I would put him on blast in the group chat because I hated him before, um, but I looked in our bank account and someone zelled Juan, Compton Juan. I know you don't work here anymore, but then I'm like, is Vic Payne Juan from Brown Bag? So I called Embezzling him. Embezzling funds. Yeah, so I called him and I'm like, hey Vic, what's this charge like to the Brown Bag? And it says to Juan. And he's like, oh, yeah, probably like $16. Like, no, it says $150, bro. Mm. And then he's like, what? That's crazy. And while he's doing that, he's like checking the date. And it was last podcast. And I was like, oh, wait, that's for the pan con pavos. Like, that was me. <laughs> I, the, the dude that, that we paid, his, his name, name was Juan. Juan. <laughs> but I immediately went like, why the fuck are we paying Compton Juan? <laughs> the fucking brown bag. We kicked him out. <laughs> we didn't kick him out. We parted ways respectfully. And yeah. Juan, it's all love. And, yeah. then, and, then, and then he actually did a good job with, with Rose Carolina Media mm-hmm. with Vic, which, yeah, I, which, which I'm a fan of. I've been watching yeah. the reels. And, and I actually, because I texted the individual. I'm like, yeah. bro, this is good. Mm-hmm. Thanks, I'm like, I like it. that shit. Yeah. I like what he couldn't episodes. do for us, he did for you. So <laughs> I appreciate that. Yes, yeah. out of position, apparently. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it looks right. way better. But speaking he has of. He's heartbroken in Bad Bunny's concerts. Speaking of Vic, you have a new podcast, so cheers to that. Yeah, cheers. Cheers to Vic's new Well, part. I don't want to cheers myself. Definitely go support. Me, yeah. Um, Vic. Yeah, I want to just basically have conversations with cool people that inspire me. Um, very different than. This show, obviously, this is our dynamic. Mm-hmm. With that, I'm just trying to like talk to homies, new people that I haven't talked to before. Right. Like I did the Rosecrans Radio podcast a long time ago. I want it to be completely different, start fresh and stuff. So yeah, yeah. Thanks, thanks I for shout it. out. He he. It's Vic. Vic has always been a journalist, first and foremost. And I think this, we've given him an outlet to be Vic the 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 human. But that's really your passion to have those types of conversations. Yeah. And shout out to you for letting me use the studio yeah. every time. Big shout out. Wouldn't be possible without you. Best friends. Best friends, yes. 
<laughs> How are you, bro? I'm good. You saw Wakanda? I saw Wakanda. <laughs> no, you have to do the... Oh, yeah. The other way. <laughs> okay, first, great movie. Okay. Great, great movie. You don't say. Hold on, two, two, two. What, what? Okay, like... So right before I went to go see it, obviously you guys saw the last podcast. I was like, "Don't talk about it," and I'm glad we didn't talk about it because everything was like hella, like, "Oh my god, oh my god!" Like the movie was really oh, good. Oh, like you didn't have spoilers. Yeah, like I didn't even have because like, you were you were saying you weren't gonna spoil it, but little a little bit of you just wanted to tell the whole story. I know you. It's a journalist thing. You just, well, you, he was using big like words, so you wouldn't understand. <laughs> I was speaking in code. <laughs> yeah, he was. He was. He didn't even go to college. Uh, I didn't college? go to college. I didn't finish. Okay, that's yeah. Not. That's the same thing. I'm different. not going at all. You didn't go to college either. Yeah, I did. Did you finish? Yeah, I did. Would you have your associate? In broadcasting. Come on. Fuck with me, No, dog. but you didn't need a college. You did that by yourself. Oh, yeah, my gosh. Yeah, you like that? <laughs> that's your point. <laughs> no, but look, no, but look, no, but look, it was a great movie. I, I, I loved everything about it. As we talked about, me and Letty were just, um, you feel me? We're just talking about our favorite song in that. Yeah, the one where the, you where, like the underwater song, which I like a lot. Which is a great song. I thought when so when I was watching it, I like when movies do shit like that where they like just like um, it's I'll like a lot a of bureau, yeah. it's like a lot of bureau, and then it was just obviously the the, cre- the creations of like the underworld where um. Nomad is from, and the story Namor. of Nomad is like the best Namor. story ever. Bro, Namor. 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 Yeah. Bro, his story is like you one can of the see best. why he yeah, turned yeah. into that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like food. Oh, like yeah. oh, this, this is him. This isn't going in the water. Like vibes. What I hated and spoiler alert, spoiler alert, spoiler alert. Don't watch or skip over if you haven't watched it. But if you haven't watched it, you pussy. Look, he. <laughs> <laughs> a week late. Loki, I hate that he showed this bitch the world. Like she, he let him into his hood. That's he's Mexican, boy, no, the sucker for But love. it was so beautiful, and everybody was so nice. And then you're like, no, I will not give you this scientist. Yeah. We're gonna go to war. Like yeah. I did not like okay. that. That's what teased her. Yeah. What do you mean? Like, teased? like he was kind of like, okay, like, like he was like, look, this, this yeah. is why I do everything. This is why I do he it showed for. her everything, and then it was like, bro. All my people are positive except me. The fucking scientist isn't going nowhere. Well, you got to see where it was coming from. Yeah, no, it I'm not mad at I'm like, hey, we got to do this because or else these gonna, humans are going to come yeah. after us through her. She's the only one that knows the way, so we got to get rid of that. Which seems logical. Yeah, that, that's logical. What, my biggest problem with the whole movie was that black and brown people fought to not fight a white person. Like, to not... I was like... Should have just got rid of the fucking FBI agent. What was he doing? That's my bestie right there. Right? Wow, bestie activity. That shit had me hot. Preach. I'm like, so all these blue people had to die and all these Wakandans had to die yep. just because you yes. didn't want to... Like, like low-key, if you think about it, to the Black Panther girl, to Shuri, yeah. you essentially were okay with your mom ending up dying versus yes. giving up this person you have no relationship to. Yeah. That actually makes sense what this fool is saying. Like, hey, she knows the codes. She knows how to make shit that can identify us. Let's let's just get rid of her. Yeah. And also and, and, and also, I think his thing was kind of, yeah, it's because to him, he the way he lost, like, I think his mom and stuff his like mom. that. Yeah, it, it, he saw it, it already. Yeah, what like, happened? Mm-hmm. Like, he's like, you don't but I love how his people are super behind them. Yeah. But even how he was, she was mad at the world because of what happened to Black Panther, Chadwick, yeah. right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. T'Challa. And he's like, hey, remember when you said you wanted to burn the world? Let's do it together. Like, yeah, that's that a was fucking a bar. Love yes, that was a bar. I wanted them together. to get together. And then it's like, what the fuck, bro? They, then they, why you say that if you don't want it? Huh? Yeah. Why you say that if you don't want it? Yeah. Why you say let's burn the world down if you don't really want to burn the world down? Facts. Okay, but let's not just put it on her. Let's put it on the it's fact. It's on her. It's on her. Let's put on the fact that her, she was trying to follow morals. The Wakandas aren't known for killing. They don't like killing. You know what I mean? It's just, it's just sometimes. But sometimes, but sometimes you gotta, you gotta do, do what you gotta do. That's you why Killmonger came look, up look, and was like, yo. There's some shit we you gotta, gotta do. You gotta do some yeah. shit. That, that you don't like. That, yeah. That's what leaders do. Yeah. But also, I didn't. And they didn't have no problem killing the blue people. Yeah, at all. Yeah, no all problem. Times. But if they were white. Like uh, <laughs> oh, poor FBI agents. Yeah. No, no, but look, but look, also when I was when 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 I was watching the shit, I was like, damn, see, but this like little 19-year-old girl from Boston, like, 
She didn't have no idea what she was doing. I don't think she intentionally did that to detect. She didn't. No, vibrate. she's Ironheart. You know who she is if you watch Marvel for a long she's, time. She's the she's the girl version of. Uh, no, no, she's not. She's the daughter of War Machine. War Machine, Don Cheadle in the Iron Man movies. Okay, I'm wrong. I'm, I'm out of here. Yeah. Okay, All right, I'm going to head out. I get, <laughs> I get it. I get it. I get it. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, that was interesting. Yeah, so she, so her dad is like a super high-level yeah. scientist. And this is what you'll get on the Rolls-Crans Vic podcast. No, no, no. Further. Exclusive sneak preview. Yeah, yeah. See, but see, I'm like, see, but I don't like that. I never trying to kid. I'm like, don't kid her, dog. Like, what about? Yeah, Add don't kid her. I get it. Don't kid her. It's not, no one wants that. Yeah, yeah. But also, it's like, you have to think, like, now. Now my whole civilization is at stake because she figured out how to find us. So to him, I get his logic. It's like, hey, we get rid of her so that they don't come for us. They won't have the key. Because what yeah. are the FBI people going to do? They're going to grab her and force her to make yeah, more of Yeah, because she didn't have no bad intentions. Yeah, yeah no, that's yeah. what I'm saying. But it was, the, it was the white people, the FBI yeah. agents and... Julia Lewis Dreyfus, whatever from Seinfeld, yeah. she had the bad intentions. And then I still think they could have worked it out where the girl went to Wakanda, mm -hmm. but then Lupita, we shout out to her because she's Mexican, but she went <laughs> underwater and she killed one of the like chill ass bitches. She <laughs> yeah. killed one of the servant bitches. Yeah. So that's why it was war. She yeah. Consuelo. Yeah, she killed like this bitch. Who, all she was doing is giving her fucking papaya and then she fucking killed her. That's what set which the which shit which off. Lupita, yeah. the, um, Lupita Nuango. Yeah, Nuango. the one that felt that went down Don't and the then fatty. to save the princess? <laughs> to save the princess, but she didn't have to kill the she's other Latina. bitches. Yeah. yeah, she's Mexican. She's Mexican. She's Mexican she's and Kenyan. Born in Mexico. What's up? Yeah. She's oh, ours. she's Mexican and Kenyan? Yeah, yeah. she's Kenyan Mexican. So she's Mexican. African and Beaner. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. She do got a thing on her. <laughs> she got a what? She got a thing on her. Yeah, she does. You feel me? I, I, I love it. Shout out. Her name's Lupita. Her name's why Guadalupe, dog. <laughs> Yes. Damn, so she killed. Yeah. Oh, okay, I can't know what you're talking yeah. about. It's coming it back started, to me. I think they could have talked out yeah. the other shit. Whoa, whoa. But it's it, like once she killed, like, and remember, he goes down to help heal the little girl and the, the yeah. girl. And then the other lady was like, Look what you did. You let them down here. You gotta go. Yeah. 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 Fucking kill his bitch. I, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, though. Them going, the fight between the big blue guy and then um the bald, the bald girl. The one in the yeah, bridge, yeah. when, yeah. when, when yeah. that's a squabble right yeah. there. They was chugging that ball. Dude, the, what, the the female Wakanda warriors are bad fucking ass. Yeah. Like, I like they them. were yeah. fucking. Hey, they're killing deep shit. though, fool. Yeah, webbacks. Yeah. We're deep, dog. Okay, they under. Okay, <laughs> let's talk about how the Wakandans underestimated how yeah. many people were underwater. <laughs> that's a lot of motherfuckers down there. That's so many. It's like when I kill ants <laughs> and they keep coming back. There's still like five thousand oh, so trillion. Hey, I'll kill they, a bunch of them. When and they called the war, they didn't even know they were still. Still so many people coming up yeah. that fucking yeah. Uh, hey, no, the, no, the no. That shit had me dead when <laughs> when they like that's just really like fool they're fucking fool they're we're Mexican like yeah. Somehow, and he said so, what did, Namor said he's like I have more warriors than you have blades of grass. Yes, that shit was, it was a bar. bar. Hey, can we talk about yeah. how he spit nothing but bars the bars entire the time? time. But it's fucking bars. 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 The only thing I like it was cool. I, I, I see why it was cool. But like his stupid little his his wings on his neck. On his oh yeah, those yeah, look stupid. CGI, I was like, bro. CGI is fun. They're like, yeah. I was like, bro, there's no way this was heavy. They eat a lot of beans and rice. Like, yeah, they look stupid. <laughs> yeah, no, that yeah. one eats nothing but mariscos. Food. Yeah, hell out guachiles down there. Huh? It's because they made the wings look like fishy wings. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, if they would have made them like gold or metal or some yeah, shit, like godly or like yeah, wings or something. But honestly, yeah. that story like, about how his mom died yeah. and how the plant saved his people and. Yeah. That's honestly one of the best stories. I, I like, like it. You know, yeah. Or how he got his name when he came nah. back up and then the guy was like, Un niño sin amor. Sin amor. Yeah. And then he's like, that's what you're talking That's what the tiger did. Hey. Super yeah, tiger. He, <laughs> the uh, he killed all the uh, Spaniards. Yeah. Yeah. That was like, wow. Shout out. I ain't gonna lie. Shout and out And you like it. Wait, I do, so I do. That, means, that says a lot. I do like when he killed the Spaniards. Yeah. Because like, see, subliminally, Marvel, is it Marvel? Is Marvel, right? Yeah. yeah. Marvel's doing like this thing where they're incorporating Latinos more and shit like that. Yeah. And by like little subliminal shit like, Right there, obviously, it was just a village, but we really know what it meant. Like, when yeah. we got conquered and people were dying. Exactly. And yeah. tell me, the people don't like the people from Apocalypto. Well, they're supposed well, to yeah, be like Mayan. Aztec. <laughs> <Mayans> <laughs> the people in Apocalypto were Mayan, too. Dude, I was like, dude, I know that guy. <laughs> I, I know that guy. <laughs> I'm like, I see you behind the scenes, motherfucker. Do you think that you're Mayan or Aztec? There's other ones in Who's Mexico. Cooler? There's like Toltec. Who's cooler? <laughs> I don't know. Well, who's cooler to you? Um... I think they're both great things. I mean, I don't know. I think I'm for sure Mayan because Salvador is Maya, and then mm -hmm. I think my dad's like Guatemala. Right. Like Guatemala is too. Yeah, and then Guanajuato is kind of closer to, I guess, where the Mayans are. Oh, so I don't know. Maybe I'm Aztec. 
I, I think uh, ever since I saw Next Friday, I wanted to be an Aztec Warrior. Yeah, Aztec Warrior. Yeah. So I'm <laughs> I, I don't know what I am, but shit, whatever. I mean, they're both cool as shit. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. yeah you're, you're, oh, what would have been you're from cool? Europe, food. You're not either yeah. one of those. I conquered one of them. Um, <laughs> but uh, wow. you know what would have been cool? To see like the Mayans versus the Aztecs. I wonder of the time frame. Maybe, I know. Like shout out to the historians if there's any yeah. history teacher. I didn't. I love like, history, but I didn't like do that much Empire, history on it. Stuff but, like that. Yeah, when they were around, if they would have like squabbled, mm -hmm. just for funsies. Happened? Yeah. For what type of history is that? Like like world history? Uh, no, no. Chicano but studies. Chicano studies. <laughs> Chicano studies. I think it's Chicano studies. Yeah, yeah right. It? Some girl, some girl in high school with, she's like about to do that shit in college, like the whole well, fucking she, color. I don't want to do that. Shout out to her for following our people. Yeah. But you know I me, mean? I like, I don't know, I've been watching sports and shit. I'm not really. Speaking of sports. Bye, Cody Speaking Bellinger. of sports. Damn. Damn, we lost Eric yeah. Bellinger. I <laughs> fucked the fuck up. <laughs> I made one mistake. <laughs> what? He tweeted about me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, fool, I'm sorry. Take that was a good mistake. Now, who are you going to mistake? <laughs> Cody Bellinger and Eric Bellinger? Yeah, it's gone. Oh, why is he leaving? I don't know. They're but they say they're gonna try to resign him. They're oh. gonna try, but but he's probably asking for a stupid bag. Yeah. Nah. But you don't deserve a stupid bag if you didn't really do much. I think the Dodgers realized that they looked in their clubhouse and said, "We don't have any, <laughs> you know, they don't have any dogs oh. in the clubhouse," and they're like, "Look, Cody Bellinger, not a dog." They're get just him out. to get him everybody out. out. Yeah. We need peace in we here. We need, yeah. Get rid of fucking Dave Robbie's fucking We need, we need more Mexicans, Dominicans. We need yeah. that salsa, the flavor. Um, you know what I'm saying? Whittier Greg. Greg Secret and Power. He uh -huh. told me that there's a rumor that we might, Greg? I call him Whittier Greg. That we might get Aaron Judge yeah. with that money. That would if, be, no, that'd be good. That'd be cool. But, he, but, he's, but, all, yeah, but he's not a, dog. a problem. Yeah. Yeah, he's not. He's, uh, he's 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 a superstar. We need those too, but we had too many superstars, not enough dogs. Ooh. Yeah, we need for we need a glue. It's a ball. Yeah. Bestie yeah. has balls. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah, we need like Because who's gonna do the dirty work? Yeah. Like we need a pool. Who? Like a puy? A puig. 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 He's a puy. A puy. Hey, puig is in trouble with the law right now. We might. Damn. He might need us. You, you heard that? <laughs> he what did he us. do? You didn't hear? You guys didn't hear about puig? I think I read about it. Yeah, he got arrested. Um, Damn. I don't want to like misquote for what, but it was like some illegal gambling shit. Damn. Yeah, he's he was betting on his own games or something. Yeah, some shit like yeah. that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That my don't ass. quote us, but <laughs> from Cuba, I, don't, I don't expect any. Don't send his plugs either. <laughs> yeah, that is crazy. But yeah, no, we need we need some just players players with more fire. So I'm as like as good as Cody was. It's like all right, it's time to move on. He'll go to like Seattle or something, have a great career. It's cool, yeah. you know. We need we need a mix of different or, players. Or we need to just get a day. We need to get rid of Dave Robert. Yeah, he might not be a dog either. He might not, you know, be a dog, dog. trainer. Let's be honest. Look, and, and I'm going to just say this. But we need somebody that's willing to take on the challenge to be a fucking different type of manager. This was so used to being like, oh, I got the best team. I'm in LA yeah. with the Dodgers. Like, yeah. Look at yeah. the for look at the dude that was managing the Houston Astros. Dusty Baker? Bro, he took a challenge that nobody wanted to take at the moment. Yeah. They just came back from fucking cheating. They got yeah. they got caught. All the heat that was coming to them, he knew that each one of their players was going to get a ball thrown at their head. Yeah. He knew all of that. But stuck around, dogged it out with them, put them food in their place, gave them good energy, and look, they won a fucking championship. Yeah. yeah. They got to develop, Dusty Baker. He was a player. former Dodger. Former Dodger. You know what I mean? So yeah. shit like that, man. And then, yeah, I don't know. We need a fucking dog. Yeah. Talking about sports, though, the World Cup is here, you guys. Yeah! Mexico, Mexico, yes, Armo, yes, Armo. We yeah. Honestly, fuck the World Cup. We can't drink there? Yeah, we can't drink there. Wow. Or the, remember, we already talked about the luchador more, masks. More, yeah. Can't wear luchador masks. Can't um, yell certain things. Yeah. Can't do chants. That's our, I feel like that's our shit yeah. as Mexicans. They, I think they're out. They basically outlawed Mexicans without outlawing, outlawing Mexicans. Mexicans. I agree. There's um, so many Mexicans making that voyage over there. Like yeah. right now, you see them on social media. Everywhere, like people I follow personally, like oh my brother and my dad are flying out there. Yeah, even all the Talcotex are there. Yeah, what's that? Where Namor's from? Shout out Namor. Yeah, <laughs> Talcotex. I don't know Talcotan or something. Isn't that the name? Of them? I don't know. Did don't you watch it? Yeah, yeah, I did. Oh, well, yeah. I was just saying we're all there, yeah. except us. Yeah. Yeah, they're saying you can't do like religious things either. So I was even thinking like the you know how people do the. Um, yeah. I'm so pretty sure rules. you can pray. Food. I mean, I don't know. No, look, look. 
fans uh, face religious restrictions. All right, so by the time this airs, Mexico will have already played its first game. But Against Poland? Yeah, upcoming game is the real shit where it's fucking brown on brown. It's going to be, well, actually, like. Not a Spanish. Yeah, actually. They folks look all like, like dick mm. just with long hair. So it's going to be <laughs> Mexico versus Argentina on Saturday. Woo! And that's going to be a lot to watch. We're going to whip that ass. We're going to make it real messy for them. When you say we, hey, who do you okay? mean? Okay. Uh, us. When you Mexican, say us, yeah. okay, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta be specific. Well, he came with a bar today, yo. Yeah, yeah, a bar you know right there. This we're hanging out too many rappers. He just interviewed Blue Books, that's why. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like all weekend I've been like that too. <laughs> I was just spitting bars to these houses. Hey, you bro. interviewed them here. Next time you interview them, like, can you get a drop for me? Yeah, like, I that's, that's all I want. Yeah. Like, easy. I want to know them. Yeah, they're hard. Shut up. They're hella cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, but Mexico is playing. It is scary, though. Yeah. Because of Messi. It's his last World Cup. He's that was about to hang it up, and he's on a mission to win it because he hasn't won one yet. Right. And uh, Mexico, I think the team they drafted, the team they picked out, the players they picked up, it isn't the best team. They should have picked the Vela. I get it. People yeah. feel have mixed emotions about him. He doesn't play, you know, on quote unquote on a real league. He plays right. in the MLS, which in the soccer world is kind of looked down upon. It's kind of what people go for the last resort or their ending or just for a check. Mm-hmm. Right. But I feel like Vela proved himself. He did, which just win a World Cup. I mean, a World Cup. He did just win the MLS championship right. mm-hmm. with LAFC. Yep. And I feel like he should have been on there. I feel like they should have showed him. Even if he just went as like as a bench player. As a sub, yeah. yeah. He's still somebody that's been in soccer for so many years. Played in high leverage games. And and you know, his experience would have been good for these young guys upcoming, but yeah. who knows what they do. I mean, we should Ochoa's be having back though. Ochoa's back, but he, he's not starting either. I don't think so. Is he starting? Mm. Can, can we fact check? We'll I don't think out. he is. What's the starting lineup for Mexico? Ochoa's the can goal. Can you tell us? Yeah, shout out Ochoa. Damn, Ochoa against Brazil um, a couple years ago. That was one of the best performances I've seen by a goalie in the World Cup. I love the Ochoa memes. Yeah. When no for penal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when, uh, when it was like, if you want your daughter to stay celibate, like, get her an Ochoa. Like, it was just like a bunch of shit. Like, remember that? Yeah, that show's funny as fuck. Awesome. Awesome. Where There's are you guys going to watch the game? Um, it's tomorrow. tomorrow. Well, the, the Tuesday game. I'm, I'm watching at no, home. No, the Saturday. Oh, Saturday. Oh, right, what time is it? Early as hell. Last one too. Oh, that eleven. Oh yeah, I might go for some mimosas. Okay, so okay, oh, Ochoa is starter. Yeah, shout out Ochoa. I'm hosting like a watch party. You guys don't have to come, but it would be really. Oh, nice. at the pad? No, at Hollywood Park Casino. Oh, we have the all the back room. Oh, is, is, is that what you just posted on your story? Yeah. Twenty one plus. Yeah. <laughs> I'm bringing come the babies. I'll be there. Food, drinks, all of us. That's okay. Vibes. So our oh, yeah. forwards are. Um, can you zoom in just a little more, Mafa? It's Raúl Jiménez playing forward. Alexis Vega. El Chucky Lozano, mm-hmm. our middle is Luis Chavez, Edson Alvarez, Hector Herrera. Shout out Hector Herrera is a yeah. legend. Yeah. And then the the defenders are I'm not too I'm not big on soccer, so don't left wing back wing bullshit me, all right? <laughs> Jesus Gallardo, <laughs> Cesar Montes, Hector Moreno, and George Sanchez. I don't, I'm not too familiar with everybody. And then obviously our goalie, our legend, Memo, Memo. Memo Ochoa, which he deserves. But yeah. Carlos Vela should have been up there, man. Yeah. I feel like he earned that. Um, I think my homie that actually Salvadorian, I wear at the gym today, he was super cheering on for you, the US. But he was like, <laughs> that was like, he's like, yeah. I'm like, the only one not clapping. Everybody else is like, they ended in a draw, I believe. What, what? happened? They didn't. Oh, predicted. Just predicted. Yeah. It's not the yeah, final. Yeah. Oh, I think they do it right oh. before the game. They oh, they do. Okay, the okay. Lineup. But most likely. Most yeah. likely is this. Most likely. There's like always like an inside type of thing, right? Yeah. yeah. Kind of what they predicted. It's a good lineup, but I feel like a, a lot of young upcoming players were were left out. And, you know, but shout out Mexico. We always do okay, but we need to do yeah. great. We and who do. knows? This might be the right team. The Virgencita, you feel me? She's always there with our yeah. team. And who knows? We might go to. Well, she's not out, allowed there. She's not allowed there. <laughs> <laughs> Facts. Shit. Imagine the Virgencita like, just getting yeah, screwed out. Like, like, sorry, Virgencita. They were like tucking your chain. They're like Debo out there. My whole thing is like they knew what this country was before they like organized it there. Like why do it there if there's so much, first of all, bad shit that's going on in that country because it's known for being violating so many human rights, right? Mm-hmm. But then all of these restrictions that they're putting on to everybody coming, it's like, what did you guys not look at this before this happened? They're fun suckers. Yeah. Yeah. And honestly, there was I don't know if you guys remember They're this is years suckers. ago. They actually was like a big lawsuit and like a whole big fiasco about them getting this this there because they got it 
very shadily. Mm. They, you know, backhanded under. They didn't even have a stadium. When they, yeah, yeah, they yeah. won the bid, they didn't have a fucking stadium. And also, at least we know that, at least when it comes to soccer-wise, their country, the team actually did lose. They, they did. lost 2-0 against Ecuador, mm-hmm. yeah. which was the first game. So at least we know that they're not like... If they're they're, gonna, the, the more they lose, the matter they're going to get. They're going to start oh, out, outlawing saying. more shit, yeah. bro. They're going to outlaw Qatar losing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> and that's scary. You're in the Middle East. And yeah. It's going to be a little tricky, sticky, icky. Yeah. <laughs> the South Africa one was fire. The shit is just... Yeah. The way that it's set up, it just feels very the weird. The songs even suck there. <laughs> Dog, you can't top secure a song. Yeah. Hey, hey, Legendary. Oh, this is let's go. Look at those hips. I was in fifth grade. Look at those hips telling the truth. You feel me? <laughs> but yeah, let's just hope Mexico does good. Okay. Come on. No fue penal. Mexico. Forever. Mexico. No fue penal forever. What you guys do this weekend? Tell us about your weekend, Duno. Oh, actually, I have to reclamarte. Why? So Duno dropped a song. Incredible song. Who's gonna rave? Shout out Bailey J. <laughs> I had never heard the song until he put it in the group chat. Vic had heard it before. I had it. I'm in love with this song. I love it. And then I'm like, I'm so happy about this song. I freaking love it. Hey, let me borrow your key. You like that? <laughs> yeah. Like, all of that. And then I see there's a fucking music video. And I, I hit you. Didn't I hit you? Yes, you Like, bro, I wish I was in this music video because I love this song so much. Was I in it? Ask me. Was I in it? Were you in it? No, I was not in the wow. video. Okay, it really hurt. To be fair, it was three in the morning. Everybody was off drugs except me, and it was just it, it, it's not even a music video. The homie just had to record a bunch of ratchet shit and Nas balloons and tequila and Hennessy and and the bolsitas. There are times that I like you represent all that I can't do being married. Yeah, and I just wish I could be a part of it. Yeah, I know. It I know. really hurt me that I couldn't be a part of this video. But you're there in spirit. I'm you know? not. You definitely were. I'm not. I was like, let what the. Had a great time though, bro. I had yeah, a crazy. That's weekend. a great video. Great song. song Go download it. Fuck the cops. Fuck fuck the cops. Fuck the cops. Fuck fuck the cops. Fuck, 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 fuck. Hey, your keys. You like that? Yeah. The homies definitely be saying that. <laughs> I'd be like, you can't borrow my key. This is my office keys. <laughs> Go look for somebody else that does not. Does. I just like that you try everything, Duno. Yes. I'm a fan. I like that you're someone that's like, hey, I want to do that. And then you go do it. Facts. Yeah, you know what? Uh, this this, this, this specific scene here, the EDM scene, the house music scene, I, I really want to respect it and earn mm. the 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 craft. I don't want to do anything that I feel like I haven't earned. Right. So, like, I, I'm learning, like, it's the real. Respect. I'm learning, like, the real element. Shout out Valentino Khan. The one thing mm. I asked him when, like, we got in touch, and he knew I was a fan of his shit the first time I ever went to a raid, which was beyond. I was like, hey, fool, is there something like you give advice about doing shit like this? And um, he was like, yeah, always make your own music. He's mm-hmm. like, that's always important. That's how, that's how DJs stay unique. And and I've just been like learning, you right. feel me? Because people were like, do no things he can do whatever he wants because yeah. he's popping. And I'm like, no. I'm like, I just happen to be popping before I do it. Right. And you so know it what has I mean? Attention. And yeah. the tension it gets. It. But 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 it's a learning craft. Like I yeah. like I made sure like I did the song with the homie Bailey. He did most of the shit. I just I like mm-hmm. added yeah. some lyrics and like you know we like went back and forth with ideas. Yeah. You know I added the funniness to it. Try to do something I love different. That so much. Even the name like I had thought of a name I was it, and then the homie fucking like corrected like that. Like, oh, what about if we do this? Wow. And I'm like, oh, this is fire. And Jose did the cover art. Great cover yeah, art. Great Shout cover out Jose. Art. Everybody. Oh, yeah. which, Jose which, which, which I sent it to a lot of different DJs and they're like, this cover art's fire. Yeah, shout yeah. out to you, Jose. Big yeah. up to you, bro. Killing it. So there's, there's a lot of different things that we like, but it's something I really want to learn how to do. Like, I really want to learn how to like DJ EDM music. I've been like watching the hella YouTube videos on there while I'm doing other shit. I'm fucking. I love it. I'm like planning on buying a gang of shit. So yeah, it's, it's fun though. The scene is crazy. That's dope as fuck. And to be fair to the haters of Duno, he's been doing anything he wants. Yeah. yeah Before he was popping, like, he dropped, what, when you dropped your, your homies, rap album, like, homies. that shit, that was like, I mean, you were like popping, but not like how you are now. Yeah. Oh, yeah right? Facts, and it was just like, fuck it, let me try it. And you went full fledged in. I yeah. was at those sessions. You discovered Jakarta. You did all this shit. So it's wow. like, you're not just doing here these just things because them. you have like newfound fame. It's like, this is what you've been doing. It's a oh, yeah. I, I like, you started podcasting out of nowhere, too. Oh, yeah. I like doing all types of shit. You know what I'm saying? So it was like, before, before it was just skits, then it was podcasting. Then it's like, why not? Why yeah. can't Mexicans try every fucking thing? 
Yeah, you know. We're, you, we don't deserve to be in a fucking box. Yeah. And you got to do everything. Like, if fucking, I don't know, whatever the fuck. Like, yeah, yeah bro. Like, and we, Mark Wahlberg does it all. That fool does it all. What the fuck? <laughs> Why can't do no? Exactly. Fuck, fuck, fuck the cops. Hey, we fuck. got a present. Hold on. Do you think that the guy that <laughs> was listening to that song? Oh, oh, oh shit. <laughs> Damn. Fuck. <laughs> no? Yes? Okay, what's oh. that? All right. Bring it oh. in. Bring oh, it in. Dark awesome. humor. Dark humor. Angie. 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 Twerk on me, Letty. Twerk, twerk on me. me. The fuck is Did that? Angie twerk, you guys? Vic, Vic would have twerked on me. <laughs> <laughs> Angie. Fuck. She says she doesn't, want Angie. You, she doesn't want you to sink. Serious question. Do you know how to twerk? She knows how to hula. Okay, you guys know this is you know also our Thanksgiving episode, so we have to do Thanksgiving content here. Yes. Yeah. yeah shout out to everybody watching us with your with your family, oh, yeah, yeah. and if you're not around your family, because it's fuck your family. Oh but my god. Don't regardless, fuck. we're your family. It's fuck your family. It's, <laughs> hey, sometimes I ha a lot of people hit us up. We're their family. Yeah, no, nah, yeah. she's gonna kick it with us. But before we oh, complain, this is, this is gonna drop on Thanksgiving. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So before hey. we complain, so before we complain about our families, <laughs> you guys, I did. I did. We got a lot of complaints. You guys, I did drugs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. It's not funny. Ooh. Hey. Hey. I did drugs. Oh, yeah. Okay, talk to me. What's up? Angie, do you love me still? Yes, I literally walked like a whole hour to get you that right now. Thank you. Were you walking in the middle of that tower with a casasuli in hand? <laughs> Real one. She said, fuck the cops. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck the oh. cops. Oh. Hey, before, let me borrow your keys. You should have said that, Angie. <laughs> Here, look. That's what this is for. You didn't know that? Shut up. You knew that. You were rich, fool. You know I you know. got like 30 of your house. <laughs> You, you buy that when you're bored. Fuck the cops. Fuck. Those are flower bases. Yeah. I wish there was a more cop friendly one because I actually do not hate the cops. Shout out. Shout out. Deirdre only... is yeah. my, my yeah. best friend, LAPD officer. Yeah, shout out. I thought I was your best friend. Ah, uh, true. 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 Oh, She's going to arrest you, fool. <laughs> Mrs. Find... Officer. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> 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 I know what Lil Wayne was talking about. I didn't know then. I know now. <laughs> <laughs> no, but look. Okay, so I want to go see the Martinez brothers. I'm not putting this on the Martinez brothers. But you feel me? So I have a friend. Oh, fuck, I should have said his name. Huh? I have my homie. He's wild. Um, he's super, super, super dude. Like, super you guys, dope. let me tell you guys. He pretended to be a bartender and handed all the homies beers. That's hilarious. At the event. How did he do this? Kelly, am I lying? How did he Bro, do Bro, dog, he just grabbed a bag of ice, and the homie dresses like a super active hipster that grew up in the hood, yeah. which is exactly his background. Yeah. And um, he walked back there, he was just pouring ice, helping the bartender, and just handing the homie beers. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, like, he put that to be a bar, but like, 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 what was it called, bar bag? Yeah, yeah, bar bag. A bar bag. Bro, and it worked. There's video proof of this. I'm going to get the videos, but you got to blur his face on Sam. That's amazing. Which is all good. You know, peace and love, bro. This player, yeah, yeah. Player. peace and love. Okay, so he, the whole time, he's like, Duno, I'm going to put Molly in your water. Duno, why, Duno why, why you're going hard and why you're talking to me, I'm going to just pour Molly in your mouth. He kept telling me that. I'm going to put Molly in your mouth. I'm going to put Molly in your mouth. And I'm like, fool, don't fucking put Molly in my mouth, fool. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm not playing the shit. Yeah. Okay, at some point, I got too fucked up. We're drinking Casamigos, taking shots of everything. You feel me? And dog, for some reason... I was I blacked out for like two hours, came back, blacked out for another 30, came back, went to a different club, blacked out at the club, came back 20 minutes, blacked out again, and then I don't remember. So the it's next day, so the next day I wake up with a cruda, but fool, I'm like, you guys are old, so you guys get different type of crudas. I still get the like ah my head hurts, but then I just take an advert and I'm good and make myself throw. Dog, I was shivering, fool. Like oh. I was cold, fool, and I was and I was tired and I felt like I needed to cuddle. And I was like, oh, this you, you were sad? I was depressed. You had the way. come down. Yeah, he the had the come, come down. down the <laughs> and I was like, ah, oh, fool. And then the homie was like, are you good, fool? And I'm like, you motherfucker. He's like, whoa. I'm like, did you fool put Molly in my drink? But when I'm drunk, I don't give a fuck. So I'll do shit like if all the homies have beers, I'll, ah, I'll drink all this, yeah. you know, just me being a dick and just be having fun and drinking. And I think I drank some Molly water, dog. Yeah. I didn't like how I felt the next day. But I, I remember my night being the funnest night of all. I'm not encouraging people right? to do Molly, but the next day I felt like I wanted to cuddle away. Like I just wanted to cuddle all night, way, all day. Way. <laughs> 
But I was cold, <laughs> but the sun was hitting me. I was sweating. I finished the full soda. I haven't done that in six months. <laughs> I was going through it for like, <laughs> dog, my style. Like, I felt like, fool. I was just like, I was going through it. Wait. Been there, brother. Yeah, um, for like my 28th birthday, all the homies. That um, was a year ago. <laughs> no, it was like two years ago. Uh, all the homies made me uh, drink a Molly Dello. That's not safe at all. It was. It's, it's the same thing as Molly water. Nah, I think Molly water. If we still a little more hydrated. I mean, it was. It it turned out fine. I had a great time. It was a good birthday. But it was very much that same scenario. Like I was like, no, no, I don't do drugs. You know, dead ass, I don't. And they were like, come on, it's your fucking birthday. And I'm like, no, no. And then they were like. Well, there's Molly and everything, so have fun. Like, drink whatever you want. It's too <laughs> late. <laughs> and you guys, we're not encouraging you to drug your homies. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah. But if you're, like, real best friends, it's cool. Like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I was with Safe P. I was, like, with my family. Yeah, man. I was with, like, all the yeah, homies. Yeah. Like, but, but also, I'm pretty sure he didn't do it. I'm just pretty sure I saw him, and I was already blacked out drunk that I drank some of his shit. And that's that's my fault for being a fucking explorer, you know? Wanted to be, <laughs> yeah. a, met- wanted to be a teacher and the homies drink. You know the explorer. And then uh, the next day, you know, mom, I just wanted to cut a fool. <laughs> Cheers right. to Letty. Cheers to Letty. Yeah. Cheers to Letty. Yeah. Molly and Molly Water. Where's Angie at? Cheers Angie. to my best friend. Where, do you have your shot? Yeah, that's for Letty. Yeah, she says she, oh, she has her cup. She's coming. Ooh. And then yesterday, I took my mom to the strip club. Oh, yeah. You have to talk to us about that. Dude, I took my mom to the strip club, and my mom loves strippers, dog. <laughs> mom's, mom's a stripper fiend, no okay? cat. Why? She was just like having hella fun with the strippers, oh, sl- you got your cast off. slapping their ass. She was trying to tip them extra. I'm like, Mom, I just spent a lot of money in this motherfucker. I want to say cheers with you. Cheers. Cheers, 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 cheers. 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 You're about to. Hell yeah. Estas son las mañanitas. Que cantaba Rey David. Hoy por ser día de tus santos te las cantamos a ti. Despierta, Leti, despierta. Mira que ya amaneció. Take it away, Vic. Ya los pajaritos cantan. La luna ya se metió. Boom. And the, beat, the beat switch. <laughs> Qué lindo está la mañana. En que vengo a saludarte. Saludarte. Venimos todos con gusto. Con gusto. Y placer a felicitarte. Feli, 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 sorte. Que bien amaneciendo. Y a la luz del día. And then everybody starts going crazy. The fact that I know Vic's family Cheers. only Cheers. sings happy birthday in English, I just mm-hmm. found that out right now. No, that's not true. Vic's family. No, it's not true. They sing happy birthday, cha cha cha. No, no, no. <laughs> no, my, my, my grandma will sing. Your grandma. Yeah, my grandma will sing man, uh, uh, Mañanitas. Mañanitas straight. She, you know what she straight. used to do? You know how we have those um, those old school ass like entertainment centers that have like the big ass speakers and like the twelve t- CD changers. Yeah, you remember those? So she would play the CD of it and then just turn it all the way up at like six in the morning on my birthday. It's pretty. Sick. Can I take body shots <laughs> <laughs> of Angie? <laughs> Whose body? You guys pick which body. Views through the roof. <laughs> <laughs> you did Molly already? Fuck, that shit was crazy. Boy. <laughs> Would I do it again? No. <laughs> <laughs> no? Hey, I think if I think if I would have like if I would have known I did it, it would have fucked with me. But the fact that I'm not sure if I did it, yeah. I would just hella blacked out of the Casa Amigos Truly Modelo and everything else I fucking mixed in. Then I'm okay with you feel me. But I had a great time, and Cali pulled up with his lover, of course. And, um, Jimena. and 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 they were having a good time. Changing the subject. Yeah. Body shots. So we're not gonna do body shots. <laughs> no, we're not doing body shots. Well, well, you know, we, we balance that cup on some. Yeah. To you. Cha cha cha. Happy your cake, buddy. birthday. What? Happy birthday, dear Letty. Oh my God. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. 
birthday to you. We tried to get your other one, but they wouldn't let us order it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Let me get the. I love you guys so much. Okay, let's eat. Can we do slice body slices? No. Let's eat. <laughs> <laughs> She's just inventing anything. <laughs> what if we put a Molly in the cake? Oh Molly cake. Oh my God, Molly Very cake. Good, well, it looks like there's fucking perico on the platform. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that shit. By the way, we oh, tried shit. to get the. Can you see? Can you it see? is a Cuban bakery. Yeah. <laughs> we tried to get the Lady M cake for you, and they, yeah. they said nah. So. Oh, really? No, thank you guys. That would have been so much better, but thank you. Because <laughs> <laughs> someone said it's my favorite cake. So I like how somebody said, puts Duno gets drugged. Like, yeah. chill. This has I didn't spread my cheeks it. open, brother. <laughs> How's Complex Con? Well, I let the cut a piece yeah. of cake for us. Complex Con was dope. Um, oh, I'm cutting for you too. You guys really want to be Mexican with oh, it. Oh, shit. It's yeah. my birthday, but I'm cutting for you guys. Wow. Well. Usually my, my mom cuts for me. Yeah, Complex Con was cool. <laughs> You're uh, a fucking grown ass adult. Sorry, Vic. It's okay. Sorry, I don't mean to interrupt you, Bestie. All right. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> 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 Sorry. Say it again. Say it again, Vic. Oh, yeah. No, it was cool. I went Sunday. I didn't make it Saturday. Lil Vic had a cold. Um, you know, as a parent, it's hard to leave the house when yeah. your kid is sick. Um, but it was cool. I ran into a lot of homies. Ran into the homie Ma Rob Markman. It's hard, but not impossible because he did it. Yeah. Well, I had to wait till he got better. I left him with my mom for like a few hours. Um, and oh, here you go. I'm listening. Um, yeah, I saw Rob Markman. Shout out the homies at Paisa Boys. Ran into Kuko. Oh, that's so cool. I yeah. want to know the Paisa Boys guys. Yeah, I'll yeah I'll set up a like a meeting. They had like a they had like a a Mexican Salvador shirt, and I oh, got yeah. it. And I'm like, I want to meet whoever made this. Yeah, shit. shout out Joey. Um, they had the honestly. You guys they, any more plates? They had one of the dopest installations there too. Yeah, I saw in your story. What mm. was it? Uh, it was like the inside of an indoor swap meet. That's that was super fire. Uh, uh, did you Wait, see Kanye this? Asada? I did not see Kanye. I think I left I before did. he got there. He has a um, Josh did. You did? Oh yeah, yeah I, I, I mean, saw Josh. It was impossible. To, like there were so many people around him. Yeah, like, it was like probably like mob. He was happy though. He looked like he was happy. <laughs> yeah, it was cool. It was a good time. Keep, it wasn't as crazy as I thought, though. I, usually, it's a little keep, like keep the slice and we'll, crazier. We'll cut it over here. Okay. I ain't gonna lie. The, the only thing I'm uh, I'm not a fan of things like that. It's very like, hipster. It's very like like like. But shout out you, cause I know you're like a big like yeah, hipster. Like like yeah. Semi -hipster, that yeah. that and you love clothing. You love yeah. like yeah. Well, that's Vic, not Vic likes being at events. Like true. he's gonna be at the openings and all of that. True, like that's true, Vic. True. That's Vic. Yeah, which yeah. but that's definitely not Dunoskis. Yeah. <laughs> like I'm not a fan of that shit at all. Oh, I, I saw this. Sorry to be horny really quick. I saw this girl that looked like Alexa Demi. Sorry to be horny. It was Instagram real life. Don't be sorry. Yeah, it was like I was like, oh my god. She was that bad. She was bad. You grab the and I was gonna call her Alexa Demi just to get her attention, and then she yeah, disappeared. Puppy. Here you go. Can someone? Grab if she was watching this. Yeah. Reach but, out to me. No, but yeah. I, but let the, do you like shit like that, like events like that? Um, Thank when you. we're like a part of it. Yeah, I see what you're saying, but I, but I could, but I, but I could also see why Vic's like a big fan of shit like that. Yeah. I would like to be a part of it. That would be definitely cool. But also, it was cool because you see like regular like like super famous people just walking around. So wow. that's kind of cool. Like Nav was there. Oh, yeah. Fucking um. Who else? Like Kanye. Oh, okay, yeah, obviously Kanye, YBN, Namir. Like, it's just a bunch of random, like, rappers that you yeah, see on the internet. Around. Yeah, and then you're just like, oh, shit. Like, like, like he said, it's kind of like Instagram in real life. So that was pretty cool. Which is fire. But, uh, but yeah, I've seen this shit. i see some of the merch boots, and I'm like, oh, they they be kidding it when they do shit like that. Yeah. And, and then I did see some of the Paisa Boy shit. And Kuku did, like, a drop there, too, right? Yeah, he did with the Wake NYC. Wow, that's fire. Yeah, so it was, it was a good time. Was like one of your favorite clothing brands? Mm. Everything I wear. Yeah. Menace, Paisa Boys. Menace is fire, but I ain't gonna lie. You know what's like my favorite thing to wear? Pro what? Club. Nah, the homies pants. Hey, I rock, I rock hey, the homies pants you. a lot. Like I'm Appreciate a, you. Like you know the the green ones are one of my favorites. Yeah. I have legendary pictures with legendary foods in those. those in the, the homie Vicks pants. In the homie Vicks yeah. pants. Yeah, be kidding Appreciate it, man. That. Are you dropping more shit like that? Uh yeah, it's like, but it's like a process, huh? It is. It when it is. comes to merch and shit like that, it is. Yeah, it takes a long time, cause like the pants that I dropped in June, I was working on them in February. You know. Yeah. So is. and then it's like, now I have to like back to the drawing board, and then another four, five, six months from after that date. You know, yeah. it's a process. 
That was fire. This yeah, definitely really wanna. Good. The kick is fire, huh? All right, you guys. It's Thanksgiving. Yes. Fuck our families. Thank you for being here with us for Thanksgiving. <laughs> Why did Angie laugh right away? We have two family complaints. Three. You don't have a family complaint this month? I'll make one up while you go. <laughs> okay. I don't really have one. I just got into my sister. That's what happened. I was like, boop. Okay. So my sister split holidays. Which? So like uh, the two older ones, because they have baby daddies, kids, and other families they got to deal with. You know what I mean? Which is all love. It's cool, yeah. you know? Do your thingy majingy for Philly for fingy. You know what I mean? I ain't mad at you. Be you, not me. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Get what I'm saying? <laughs> Have kids, not me. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But look, so, okay, so Thanksgiving, they're going to spend it with their man's family. Mm. The middle one is cool. Shout out my middle sister. She's Lamar. Hey, Jana, okay. Melo. Hey, Jana, oh. hey, Jana. Melo, me and, Cookie don't have, the, me and Cookie don't have kids, so we're always with mom. Like, mom's priority. Wow. Even though Cookie has, like, her boyfriend that she lives with and everything, Cookie's always, oh, we're going with, my, like, like, I'm going with my mom. You go with your mom. Cause you know, cause cause when you have a kid, the grandma wants to see the kids. His grandma yeah. these deals. Yeah. So, for Thanksgiving, my sisters, my two oldest ones, they're gonna be with their man's family, which is cool, you know. Shout out to family, cool as fuck. But it's just gonna be me, my me and my mom and Cookie. Mm. But then for Christmas, we usually meet the day before or the day after, so we could give our gifts we gave each other mm. that we get each other as just. Me yeah. and my sister and my brother-in-law's niece and nephews. Yeah. And then the cousin thing will do something different. But um, my family that we usually do the intercambios with, it's slowly, but sh- slowly just we're all kind of separating. Everybody's growing up. Some right. cousins don't get along with others. We've tried it. The last two, three years have been a little rough. Like people flake last minute. Oh, I don't want to do it because, you know, shit like that. We don't like one of my cousins, little, my little cousin's Ladies. boyfriends. Um. Like, you know, this food doesn't like, you know, it's just everywhere. So my mom was like, for Christmas, we're going to go to your sister's, um, your, your for your sister, Jana's boyfriend's family, which is cool. Shout out to them. I love them. You know, their family. I love my brother-in-law, Shorty. But I'm like, uh, I just kind of want to, I just prefer, can we just do us? And then they're like, no. Mm. My mom's like, mijo, wherever you're at, you're happy. If you want to be with your friends, go be with your friends. I'm like, yeah, I just kind of prefer just doing, you know, like if, if we're gonna do us, I'll just I'll see you guys the day of when we do us. And then the oldest one, Erica, you know, we bum heads a lot. I love her still, but she was like, Well, what the fuck? How are you not to be with mom? I'm like, for you not to be with mom on Thursday. And she's like, mm-hmm. Well, cause I well, cause I gotta split the days. Yeah. And I'm like, Well, that's your fault. You know, just me being a dick. Yeah. And then she invites herself to like Thanksgiving. But me and my sister Cookie and Mom already doesn't plan. I was like, but she had her on speaker. So my mom's watching her kids argue through the phone. But I'm with my mom. I live with my mom and I'm like, why is she even coming? Like, you know, but just me being like, <laughs> but I'm like, I'm fucking with her, but I'm like, dick, why are you mad? Like, why is it okay that you miss, but not okay that I miss? Yeah. But obviously the excuse is a kid. Yeah. Shout out my nephew. I love him to death too. But we just start getting into it. And then we beefing it right now. So uh-huh. then, so my mom was like, my mom was like, look me, you know, because my mom's like the peacemaker. Like, yeah. in, my, in my mom's perfect world, every holiday would be with her. So but, when you yeah. said, why is she even coming? What did Erica say? Because I know she didn't stay quiet. Well, she's like, well, what the fuck? What the fuck? I was like, fool. I was like, shut up, fool. But you know, just fucking, I was like, go here, swag it out, fool. Yeah. But you know, just making her feel yeah. better. Fuck she, you, Danny. And yeah, she was like, <laughs> she's like, well, fuck you. And then she was like, because I have, I have like, but like, in the matter, she's like, you don't even visit your nieces because my sister lives far. She lives in South Central. And I'm like, they don't visit me. And then, but I see Aiden all the time. Like, yeah. just picked that fool up like last week. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, we see, you know what I mean? But we're just arguing. But it was one of those things where it's like, they got to understand, like, it's like, you feel me? Like, I personally, for me, in my perfect world, honestly, but I feel it. They have other families now. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with that. Collar but Collar I'm not a color. I'm not a color. <laughs> but like, I'm like, bro, like, her why side is, of the story is going to be so different. I'm like, why is it okay for you to miss, but not okay if I miss? Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, like. Because a kid, you know why it's okay. No, but I'm like, but I'm like, I'm. We always do the thing where we see each other either the day before, yeah. or the day after, and we give each other our gifts, mm-hmm. the ones I got individually for my sisters, for my mom, for my nieces, for yeah. all three of my brother in laws. They all get each a gift for me, yeah. and we do that where we just meet up us. Like as siblings. Yeah. 
But, you know, Thanksgiving. But I was just like, man, why? I'm like, why is she even going? But in Spanish, you know, like, <laughs> ¿Por qué va a ayudar a que la madera y yo, yo cookie? Entonces no voy, pendejo. Ah, bye, man, bye, man. And it just clicks. <laughs> You're then, a dick, bro. But I'm like, dick, like, go, just because I don't want to spend Christmas somewhere. It's not that I don't want to spend it there, but, like, I just prefer being with my homies this Christmas if that's what yeah. we're going to do. Like, you don't really know them that much? No, I, I do, I do. Oh, okay, They've been okay. together for a long time. Yeah. I just personally... Yeah, it's just this year. You, you want to control your own environment? Else. Like, no. He just wants to There's do There's nothing wrong else. with that. No, I, I just want to do my own, like... Yeah. If it was like, just specific family, yes. But it's like, I prefer not going and going if I'm going to just leave early. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show up at 8.30, eat, and leave at 9.30. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I, like, shout out my brother-in-law. They're cool as fuck. I'm going to still hang out with them. I always make it up. And my brother-in-law's get good gifts for me. <laughs> no, Tio Duno got a little money now. So they expect my gifts. My <laughs> sisters get very good gifts for me. You feel me? They give me good gifts as well. You know what I mean? It's just one of those things where I was like, and you know, we're just kind of going a little back and forth. My sister, John, is more mellow. She's like, ah. Because this is with her family. She's going to come now. Okay, I love you. I'll see you to the next day. Yeah, right. bye. Yeah. And then me and Cookie kind of just debate a little bit. But I think I'm going to spend it with the homies. And a lot of the homies aren't blessed with family like me. Mm -hmm. So I always try to invite them. But I was like, fool, let's just hang out us. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Like, let's just do our own shit. We'll get drunk. My, I was like, my family's not going to be here. And I got an office now. Yeah. I'm like, so we could get drunk at the office or kick it out of my crib and but music and, you know, cry or whatever the fuck you want to do. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. What about you, Vic? What's going on? Man, it just sucks when I'm like notoriously neutral. Yeah. You are. Like, my whole like no, family. No, Vic, you do know you two sides. Vic, does, <laughs> Vic, you are. So, Vic understands. He's like, oh, I see where you're coming from. That's Vic. Yeah. I understand. I'm just still growing up. So I'm, I'm notoriously neutral in my family dynamic, everything. I'm always like, everybody has a problem with everybody. I don't beef it with nobody, yeah. right? So I live my life like that. I don't like to have drama, issues, whatever, especially with people that I love. And then when... It doesn't fucking matter because everybody still beefs it. Yeah. And you still have to like choose a side choose, on the yeah. holidays. It fucking sucks. And it's like getting worse every year. Yeah. I'm thinking it's gonna get better every year. I'm like, oh, people will get a year older, they'll be a year wiser. Have, like optimism. There's yeah. a new baby in your family. There's a new baby. The new and, baby it's like, in the family. Yeah. and it's like, no, things are getting worse every yeah. fucking day. <laughs> <laughs> every fucking day. He's there's a new to keep him crying. No, nah, dead ass. It's it's something new every day. And then I'm like, and I'm like, what am I doing? Like, what mm. am I doing wrong? I'm like, right. wait. You wanna be the fixer. And I'm like, I I can't really fix everything because yeah. it doesn't even involve me because a lot of the things that happen are when I'm not around. Yeah. And I mind my business so much and I'm focused on like my shit. Like my family invites me out. A lot of times I don't even pull up. I'm just doing my own thing with my son, whatever. You are very like to yourself. Yeah, I'm very to myself. Yeah. So, you know, all these things happen while I'm not around and then they, you know, Thea beefing with sister and all this stuff. And then I'm just like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck happened? Like, right. who let you guys alone with alcohol again? You know, like, oh, <laughs> you know that. what I'm saying? Like, everybody I just gets that. angry at each other. And then, like, now it's like, oh, okay, well, we're not going there and we're not going there. Mm -hmm. And then, oh, and you guys want to know what my dad did? What did he do? <laughs> it's uh, fucking hilarious. My dad is getting old, man. I swear to God. It's my guy right there. <laughs> Bro, chill the shit. What the fuck? <laughs> you said it. You know how you said it. That was cut out of the last episode, by the way. Yeah, so nobody There's knows. There's no reference. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, <laughs> well, all that cut out. That would have been great publicity for some of the All right. So, look. So, my dad sent a text to me, my tia, my sister, and my other sister. And my dad is getting old. He doesn't know how to use phones. He's, he's fucking terrible. He doesn't answer phone calls. He's just like... Phones and him do not get along. That was on do not disturb without knowing he's on the Yeah, and he has an Android. <laughs> and he has an Android. Yeah, so he like, has it on vibrate. He's like, why doesn't my phone ring? Yeah, dude. And, and that's a whole different story. So he sent a group text to all of us and said, um, Thanksgiving dinner at my house. Let me know if you're coming. So when I seen the message, I'm like, who's this like 310 number? I didn't wreck because it wasn't saved in my phone. I'm mm -hmm. like, why is he like lumping me in with some random all these person? Randoms, yeah. yeah, right. Uh, turns out that was my sister's old phone number. So my other sister was like, oh, he just didn't invite Vanessa. And then I'm just uh. like, I guess not. Like, I'm like, what the fuck? You know, oh, I'm, that's also your fool's fault. Why? why? No, we don't have her number, her old number saved. Oh, shit. It was her old phone number. So. But you don't have both numbers saved? No, I no. delete the number when it's gone. Oh, OK. You get what I'm but saying? But he just he did our accident. Yes. He did on accident. And it started like some whole shit. Oh, and like then, why you didn't invite him? Why did why isn't she invited? Da 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 da. And this is a baby sister. Yes. Yes. And then so 
Then I'm like, Dad, I think that was the old, like three days later after like some whole drama unfolds. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, Dad, I think that was the old number. I text to that same group chat. I said, I think that's Vanessa's old number. So then he's like, Oh, I'm sorry, my bad. He makes another one, adds another old phone number of hers. <laughs> She had like three, like she had like just like old numbers or whatever. So and then I'm like, Dad, oh my god, I'm like, that's not her number either. (laughs) And he's like, I'm gonna just text her individually. (laughs) (laughs) But it started like some whole shit. Like, and I was just like, damn. And like, you know, some shit just like after like you realize like, oh shit, like that wasn't on purpose. But it just started some whole other shit. And now it's just like, man, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I might just, I might hang out with you and the homies do. No, I don't know. (laughs) I might just like, fuck all this, man. And and that happens with, with like, with, especially when, because it's just you and your sister. It's just you and Monica. Well, I have an older brother in Vegas, but. But uh, yeah. mostly like we, yeah, yeah. So you guys, it's kind of a little easier to like. It's just you and Vanessa really going back and forth. I mean, if you and Vanessa, Me you and Monica, Monica, like, yeah, like if you guys like do it, together. yeah, like, yeah. And, and it's just but makes it yeah, easier. But when there's multiple, when there's multiple dog, you gotta understand everybody's or how somebody's feeling on a Monday. Right. Like my sister Cookie could be going through it on Monday, but she's okay Tuesday. Hey, Jana's always okay, but she's not gonna reply. <laughs> Erica could be mad on Tuesday, but not on Monday. So it's just like yeah. the you gotta you gotta make sure. And then sometimes yeah. like they get mad at me, they be like, "You never fucking reply." I'm like, "Cause right. fool, I don't give a fuck." Doesn't just, it trip you out? Like, how are the other people healthy and good? Like, know. how are other people like super chill and they know ex- and know my family and all of like that shit always trips me out. We have too much access to each other now. All of us, in general. What do you mean? Like, remember, okay, so, like, a long time ago, we would just have house phones and then be, like, talk to each other every three months. Yeah. Hey, I'll be there for the holidays. All right, hang up. That's it. There's no, like, wrong group text number, like, hanging out so much. A lot of opportunities for, like, situation. Yeah, for drama. Yeah, like, like, shit A lot of room for bad activities. Instagrams, like, why'd you put that shit on your close friends? Like, what the fuck? You Mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like, just room for more. I get what you're saying. Like, I think, and, 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 uh. An example, like my family, when we used to do the Secret Santa, went on with do all the names and travel to each tia's house so we could pick, pick out the names. So my aunt from from East LA was the one that usually we did at her house. Usually she had the house in City Terrace. Yeah. She would drive to Echo Park, drop it off at my mom's. We'll pick out the names. My mom would give it to my other tia, and then they'll pick out the names, and then my aunt would give it to my other tia, and then we all know what names we got. Right. But now we try to do the whole wheel shit, send the names that, oh, you forgot this name. Yeah. Bro, like me and the homies, like me and like, you guys know like the homies, like Jakarta and them, but yeah. like the original, the homies, the homies, like Andy, Sovic and them. One time we almost had a big ass argument because we forgot like the roulette names. Oh, you forgot to put this. Oh, I don't want that person. Oh, you can't do the couples. And I'm like, bro, shut the uh, fuck up. Yeah. Just write the names down, rip them and choose the fucking thing. Yeah. And then people don't know how to keep secrets. People are ruining shit on Instagram. Oh, like, yeah. I bought these shoes and I'm the only person with size, like, example, 13 and <laughs> from the friends, like, dickhead. Yeah. I know that's my present. <laughs> but family are kind, but, but we love our families, man. You yeah, we love, we love I wish we were all just cool and go to my yeah. grandma's house and nobody fought or hated but each other. But this makes me feel good because it's not, it's just every house has drama. It's all personal problems, yeah. yes. Every house has drama. No wonder... We're sitting in the sala taking pictures of our nice outfits because that's the only time we're going to be getting along to take photos of the nice outfits. Otherwise, it's fucking Plato, dog. Yeah. It's a fucking shit show. It's a shit show. It's Plato like, and, and we're probably in the sala because the motherfuckers are fighting over there. So it's like, hey, you want to take some pictures of my dress? Yeah. Like, yeah. like screaming at the fun. kids to relax yeah. while the grown-ups are getting down in the back? Yeah. But With yeah. my mom, okay, so I think this is just me, to be honest, and I don't know why my mom's like this. But she'll literally, she lies. She'll literally be like, I'm going over. And then I see that she's in El Salvador. Like, I don't know why she does that. I know you guys. <laughs> oh, I swear to God. My mom does this shit all the time where she just is not replying. And then I look on Facebook and this uh, bitch is fucking on the Mayan ruins fucking walking up the shit. <laughs> Dog, I swear to God. And then so I'm here like, hey, you're supposed to help me with this damn turkey. It's a salvi turkey. Oh. Yeah. Or like there's a bakery that is specific bakery that we get it from. The actual turkey. And it's like, hey. You know this. I don't. Do I WhatsApp you? How do I get in contact with you? It's just the weirdest shit. She's I don't like know what it is. She's just walking by herself on Christmas yeah. Eve. Yeah. Yes. She's just like Because she's like a traveler. Mm. Oh, that's her thing. That's her shit. But she won't tell us. And I'm like, dog, something can happen to you. Like this past like summer, she went to Colombia, just didn't call, check in anything. I'm like, they could kill you. And we're here like, hey, have you heard from my mom? Have you heard from my mom? <laughs> she does that. And it's tripping. It trips me the fuck out. It trips me the fuck out. I try to like... So when, when our parents are a certain way, 
I always try to think of what got them to be that way. And so this is gonna get sad, but just FYI, just for the record. So my grandma in El Salvador came to the United States with my, my tia, but left my mom in El Salvador. So I think one day they were there and the next day she only came. And so my mom is in El Salvador, like 13, 14 year old, years old. Like, what the fuck? My family just left me. So I think that that's kind of not that it's learned, but it's something that happened in her life that subconsciously she does that. She literally won't check in nothing. No, I'm going to be here. It's just one oh, day she's like, mm. I'm going over. And then she does never comes over. So I think this bitch is on de dateline somewhere dead and she's in fucking El Salvador. It's crazy. It's weird. So I don't know if any other moms are out there like that's, that, but that that's, shit is crazy. That's so like, we'll see if she comes to Thanksgiving. I don't did, know. did she say she was coming though? She said this time that she's okay. coming. But she says every time that she's She with me and the homies getting lit. She is. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past her. <laughs> no, but yeah, my family, we it, I mean, we're for we're usually pretty good at like always making sure my mom's happy. Yeah. Like even good. if we don't see each other the 24th or 25th, the 26th, we're with mom. And even if we don't make food, we'll fucking order. Fucking KFC, who fucking knows? Fuck it. Yeah. KFC like the best Thanksgiving shit. You know what I mean? And we'll do that shit and then just figure it out from there. Yeah. But you guys, if you guys aren't doing nothing, come to my house or mine with the homies or pull up with Vic. I'm gonna be by myself in the corner. Don't mind me. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh my God. Just watching your mom and your sisters lie and your dad try to figure out his phone. He's <laughs> uh, <laughs> like, uh, like uh, uh, Here's your LA News in a Minute with Rose Cranz. <laughs> <laughs> the one minute about his whole family? <laughs> Hell no, I need weeks. I need weeks. <laughs> <laughs> that's, and that's what you'll get on the Rosecrans Vic podcast. Exclusive sneak preview. <laughs> Vic, I love whatever you're doing. High five. High five. I love it. I love it over here. The first title is I Hate My Family. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna talk, no, I'm not going to talk about myself no. on the podcast. No. Damn. What's next? Oh, shit, our families are going to shit. Are you guys do the shopping at all? Like the Black Friday and all that no. stuff? I'm, I can't do it now. Cause you're doing all. Cause I'm fucking bopping uh, Oh gosh, how come? Hey, you fool, you're broke. And I'm like, no, I'm just spending money correctly. Yeah. <laughs> like, I just love a deal. Who's fighting for a TV? <laughs> 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 Yo, isn't that crazy that that really used to happen? Yeah. Like Dog all that Best shit. Buy shit, people used to fight over PS4s yeah, and all of that. DVDs. We and like, forget. Shit is insane. Shit was crazy. And shout out the people that always feel like they know where to go and how to get there and what to do. Like the homie be going like. 40 hours away. I'm like, fool, what the fuck? He's like, we don't wait in line. Fool, it's low key right there. Wow. I'm like, shut up, bitch. Just buy that shit on Cyber Monday, whatever the fuck those yeah. yeah. Black Fridays are turning into Cyber Monday because you could low key yeah. get your Black Friday stuff online. Nobody wants to get off their couch and shop. By the anymore. way, Duno didn't do his shot. No, I did do my shot. What's that? My shot, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure. That I did. shot made me sweat. I hadn't had class of Azul since the pandemic. And then, yeah, <laughs> but, but that was, that was. Black Friday some shit, but it's, yeah. it's it's tricky for me now. And like I can ever imagine like sleeping in a tent. Yeah, but even for you too, right? Like the Best Buy stuff. Well, me and my sister like going just to be a, a part of the vibe. Mm. Like I'm I, used to being up at that time anyway. Yeah. So it's like, hey, you want to go just get some Starbucks and be at Target at four in the morning? It's like, okay, let's go. Okay, so like, that's actually it's kind more of like fun. the vibe. Yeah. It's like, oh, yeah. what are they doing should over I there? Should I tell you guys when me and all my friends got costuming? Black Friday, like Kmart in Burbank. Tell us. Kmart? Okay. That's Tell a throwback. Kmart. Are you 12? It still <laughs> exists, though. It's still open. It's like the only Kmart. Oh, it really? Yeah. It's still open? I found I I found new two Kmarts. The one in front of the Grove, which is like, really, it was real popping. Mm -hmm. And then there was, okay. So high school, we had this thing where we were all hella broke. Mm -hmm. well, so we would go. Same. Yeah, like we were not, but like, we was, we was not bad. <laughs> you know what I mean? So we would go steal shit. Me and all the homies. Shout out to the homie Sovic. He had a whip. Um. And it was usually like the homie Solvik, me, the homie Andy, Allison, and just like probably another two people. I, uh, I would say like the other homegirls. And um, we would just go to stores. And one time, um, I was like, I'm going to just walk out with this shit. So we filled up a cart with like the homie got, I got like, I got like pastel. I mean, oh, cheers. Oh, let's take this. Let's take um, All right. <laughs> I got paper towels for my mom. My mom was like bugging me to go get paper towels. That's my best friend. He a real bad bitch. Got his own money. He don't need no chick. 
Yo, Angie's over there boiling. She's boiling inside over there, yo. She's like, oh my god, <laughs> typing hella hard. Like <laughs> this fucking stupid graphic. So we were, so so we used to go to the one in and um and fucking by the Grove, but that won't be a little more like hot, burned yeah. out. So we would do at the moment the homie Allison and Andy were dating. And she would always have like her duffel bag. She played softball. So me and the homie Sovic would walk around, put our socks as high as we can and be burnt out just so they could have eyes on us. Wow. And we would tell them what to get. And we would tell Andy and Allison what to get for us and we'd just come up on a gang of shit. So we allegedly. just allegedly, of course, allegedly. Oh, this, this shit is fake. Yeah, no, come kids. On. I had never done that. I, I don't think I Kmart can sue you if they don't exist anymore. Yeah, True. bankrupt ass motherfuckers. Okay. <laughs> okay, sorry. Right. You contributed to that, by the way. <laughs> 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 okay, so we go to another Kmart. It's like a regular, like three or four p.m. We we fucking we walk because because we do that because what's it called? When I was like doing a lot of graffiti, we used to do that with cans. We just walk around with the with the car full of cans, and then we just walk out so we don't pay for nothing. So I'm like, let's do this shit. So the homie got like a mirror. I got like some like tongue glass, some like cozy like at home tongue glass. I got some um. Papel para el baño for my mom. All types of shit. A fucking, wow. a fucking jacket, like a camel one. And we're like, oh, successful. The homie up in the wheel. We put everything in there. We drove off. We had the homie meet us. I hop across the street, allegedly, of course. Yeah. And we're maneuvering. Shout out, bing, bada, boom. So we're like, oh, we got it now. We got the recipe. Ooh. They're not going to follow us. <laughs> fucking Thanksgiving comes. It's me, the homie Sovic, the homie Andy, Allison, allegedly. Allegedly. And we go to, we're going to different places. But we we go to Citadel, which is like the closest to LA, where yeah. everybody mm -hmm. goes. We go there. I think we be like buy one or two things. We're like, damn, what should we do? It's, it's still pretty early. We low key found parking good at Citadel, and we're like, oh, fool, let's go hit the Kmart in in Burbank, like how we did last time. <laughs> That's go. far, Citadel to, yeah, Burbank? to Burbank, up to five. But we're 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 kids, and the homie has a car, like. It, oh. Yeah, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks. Yeah, his yeah. car okay. with twenty bucks. This shit was probably all the way. You know what I mean? Yeah. Gas at the moment was probably like two something, three. I don't know. Yeah. Twenty eighteen. How much was gas? No, it was like three, two, like three yeah, something, like three something. Yeah. Okay, so we do that. We think we got it for right. We go in there. We're trying shit on. <laughs> the whole. <Dad? laughs> oh, oh, your phone's connected to the room too. No, my dad's calling me. I can't answer. He'll yell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so. <laughs> Hello, oh, Angie. How old are it you? doesn't matter. Not even my husband. He's like pressing me when I'm not there, and then so I get there, it's like I. He makes me feel anxious, and I hurry, and then I'm there, and he's like, "Oh yeah, what are you doing? You should stay the whole night outside." <laughs> okay, but yeah. So then, and you know when your dad loves you. Damn. No, that's how you know. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I said that's how you. <laughs> Fuck it. Like so then, so like. So look, we're okay. so we're doing that. We're maneuvering, and then we think we got it, fool. But it, the store's low key empty. You know, nobody goes to Kmart for fucking Black Friday. Our stupid ass didn't think of that. We just thought, you know, ah, uh, nobody. You know, we're the only one that know the gem. Dog, we're walking out, fool. The homegirl Allison had like four shirts under her regular shirt, and we just hear, "Fucking let that car go right now, or or, or mm. we're gonna arrest you guys." A bunch of undercovers, dog. Oh. Dog, so I just let the car go and just keep walking. <laughs> <laughs> and then and I turn around, I get in the whip, the homie drives off. And we turn around and we just see Allison taking off like 30 shirts. <laughs> <laughs> but they were cool. They knew we were kids. They could have yeah. been dicks. And it would have been bad because the homegirl Allison at the moment, her mom was like hella strict. But for some reason, she let her go out with us to Black Friday. I'm like, dog, and she goes. So the plan, I told the homie like, hey, if they put her in cuffs, Park your whip, allegedly, and we're just gonna go bomb on them fools and we gotta go to jail for her, dick. That's not cool, dick. Like, <laughs> we convinced her mom to let her go out with us with her fucking horrible, bad influence friends yeah. and her ex boyfriend, her boyfriend at the moment, the homie Andy. And we're gonna, and then we we ended up being able to, we just, we they let us go and shit, but that's really what happened. That's hilarious. My favorite part about your story is that you guys stole very practical things. <laughs> Yeah. Like you stole like chunk glass, toilet paper. Oh like, yeah. Like all things that you're gonna use. Like it's like you're not you guys aren't assholes. You guys just don't like have it at the moment. Why, you know, what, like what would you have stolen? Just like 
like dirtbag so, shit, you know, like <laughs> PS5s and like yeah, TV, um, like how whatever I can like expensive electronics, like SD whatever cards. you can resell. Yeah, you know, you're like, like out of necessity, like that's fuck, what I don't I'm have saying. shoes. He's like, yeah. okay, okay, laundry, laundry, laundry detergent, yeah. yeah. <laughs> dryer sheets, like, like no ignore the, <laughs> nah, and then, and the then, cafecito. If we didn't know cap, I literally used to like sell chips, so. So like if she was doing the bottles of putting like I would come up like on sharpies like for my black books and like yeah. I would Practical come up things, on, yeah. and then and then what I would do is like I would say we need chips so we used to walk out with like the the with the with the, with the box that had a bunch of chips <laughs> so she could set them like at school and shit like that. See you know? yeah you guys are good you guys are good man. But but with certain car we had like we had a, I oh my god it would we had toilet paper a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> the homie got some shit. Like, we're honestly stealing for our moms. That's what I'm saying. That's my favorite part of the story. Like, you guys aren't, like, terrible people. Yeah, know? nah. We definitely were like, fuck. That honestly, shit. fuck Kmart. Yeah. <laughs> you know? You fuck with Kmart, Letty? I like Kmart. I fucked with it, too. Kmart was, like, the original. The original Target. Like, Kmart crawled so that Target can... Low key. Run. I used to fuck with Kmart when I was a kid. They had cool They had cool toys. Fires by that is a Ross. Ross, huh? Ross. Easy. Ross, but R.I.P. Five spotted this forever. They used to have one across from the stone with Mars to go get. I think they still have some though. Irregular T-shirts. I think I, fuck. I think they have the one in downtown. Mm. I think there's one in Van Nuys too. What about Big Lots? You guys fuck with the Big Lots? Pick oh, Big Lots was dope. Big Lots had dope ass toys too. But why were all the Big Lots always like underground? No, that's just L.A. Yeah, that's just L.A. Really? Like, yeah, the, the Valley big... had like four or five uh, Big Lots. There's one in Bellflower Sorry, guys, still. I'm texting, what did you call my dad? The big lots were, were kind of everywhere, but talking they have about, like sick ass furniture f- randomly. Big lots, yeah. And and honestly, I th- I feel like they had some of the best like candy whole, for for Halloween. Facts. You get a whole patio set though for like two hundred, three hundred bucks. Like, where'd you guys go shopping for your school supplies? Uh, mm, big lots for sure. Office Depot. Office Depot. Yeah, my grandma would take us every every year before school, and she would hook us up. Nice. And then she would take us to the swamp meet so we could get our outfits together. And I always wanted to be hoochie. <laughs> <laughs> would your grandma buy you like little shirts that said "Bebe"? Definitely it's little, bebe? little skirts for sure. I was like, Abuelita, they're they're school colors. It was like it was like beige, <laughs> but it was skirts. I feel like, I feel like, and then you kind of finesse her because she loves you guys so much yeah. that it's like, Mija, you want to be a little hoochie? Okay, Mija, here you, you go. Got it. You know what I mean? But talking about schools, there's a Satan group. <laughs> you like that? That, that was a good transition. That was good? Yeah, honestly. That was okay. You fucked with Satana. Satana. <laughs> Shout out my mom. She just into a Satana song the other day. Oh, my so God. So you would like this. So there's an after school program. <laughs> it's one of the clubs. You know, they have Pokemon Club, Chess Club, whatever club. This Chicano is like Club. Satan Club. What the fuck is going on yeah. in this school? Yeah, and there's like a little logo of a, uh, Satan that's like, it, he looks happy. Like a happy little saying, like, what hey, you guys, fuck? see you after school at the this, this, that, the third. I don't know what school, what it's district, but elementary it's... Elementary yeah. school? Can you um, can you tell us the name of the school? I think was it? it was like, who started this fucking club? This is nasty. Yeah. i take my son out of the school so fucking fast. <laughs> Facts. Golden Hills Elementary School. Rolling Hills? Golden, Golden Hills. Hills. Oh, Golden, Golden Hills, Hills Elementary Sounds School. Racist. Where the fuck is that at? Golden Hills? This is right next to the bridge by San Francisco. Yeah, Golden Gate. Good. Okay, who started this? Satan. Fullerton. <gasps> Fullerton. Wow. Fullerton. It Fullerton. smelled like Orange County. Angie, what the fuck is going on in your county? It smelled like Angie, Orange County. Angie, go protest. Golden Hill. Serio. <laughs> okay, so I want to know what the fuck happened here. Who started this club? Like the kids? It says uh, sponsored by the Satanic Temple. That's gross that there's even a Satanic Temple around. So do they rent the school? Like the Satanic... Like, do they pay the school and they I rent think, the... Yeah, I think they... they I think it's like, you know how, like, the club. YMCA is, like, a separate program, but they, like, probably... Partner. Off, partner, yeah. offer services. Okay, so le- let's Boys put it out there club. that there's no kids there. Or we're not to share that. Uh, I have no idea. I mean, after, it's I'm, an after-school Satan club. Yeah, I can't hear the audio, but... There's kids there, Jose? Yeah, usually what they do is, like, you know how some uh, Christian... Churches will host an after school after school club. Yeah, they're saying since those Christian schools, those Christian churches can do a after school club, we have so the same rights as them to host. Yeah. Oh club. my God! There Which is go. valid freedom of speech. And it's uh, happening so to a bunch of schools, but this is just, I guess, more local. This is like OD open mindedness. It's like, come on, dog. Can we make an exception for Satan to not? Yeah, let like do it at the high school. 
Like, come on. <laughs> like, at the elementary school, like, imagine, I can imagine Jorito and a little Vic just walking in and somebody being like, Satanas. <laughs> Hell Didn't your mom just finish listening to the Yes, Satanasa? which is, that's why I'm not too against it. Yeah. But that's if you're, but my mom's also a big believer in our very beautiful Virgin Mary. Yeah. But my mom just likes rock music, but my mom's not praising the fucking Satanas. Oh like, my All these little God. kids are going to come out with a vest with the spikes. <laughs> this just says, hey kids, let's have fun at after school Satan Club. Yeah. Science and community service projects. We're lighting motherfuckers on fire. I wonder if that's just to get people talking. Uh, arts, I don't like, think that. That just says puzzles and games, um, nature activities, arts and crafts, snacks, and tons of fun. Tons of fun. <laughs> what oh the my fuck God. is going? Not snack. What kind of snacks are they passing out? What kind of nature activities like the spicy fucking, little for, baby dicks, for, little candles somewhere. For they're passing out the spicy chip. <laughs> oh, the pocky. The, the one chip challenge. <laughs> oh my God. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. How? What's something that your guys' kids' school has done that you weren't too? Af- too friendly about. That would be something, right? That maybe like little Vic maybe or for Vic, yeah, cause no, just I mean like during like COVID, it was just like a lot of kind of arbitrary like little things. Like I mean, it's LAUSD at the end of the day, which is very um, like which which by saying with that is like it's so hard because there's so many fucking schools. yeah, so many schools. So it's like they have to adhere to things that probably doesn't necessarily apply to the school and stuff. But like they had to. Um, if, like, they tested positive for COVID, then they would have to be out for, like, two weeks and shit. And, like, little things like that. It was just like, damn, that shit. I w- I'm the one that has to watch them the whole time, you know? Yeah. Type shit. So little things like that and, like, um, mostly stuff like that. You know, it's nothing crazy, nothing bad. I mean, honestly, I like his school. It's very safe and secure and stuff. So, That's you know, nice. I don't have too many complaints. About what about you, Michael? <laughs> Probably just paying for preschool, man. It's just expensive. Very expensive. You guys, kids are so expensive. It's just expensive, so expensive as fuck. I used yeah. to pay so much for Vic's, um, like, private, no, private school. school? Mm-hmm. Yeah, she was expensive. You had to pay a G a month. Yeah, I was paying, like, 700 That shit's expensive, bro. Damn! Yeah. What the fuck are they teaching our kids? I don't know. Jorge can spell really well. and I'm already reading. He's four. Oh, yeah, that's pretty yeah. good. But he also has a fucking Rolex and does this shit with other grown people. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like, that's just not a regular kid, dick. Okay, so I take them to Disneyland, and then... <laughs> this is the funniest shit ever. You guys... Kids are rich. That's how I'm like, we're... We suck as parents. So there, there was a water fountain. We were waiting to, like, figure out where we are going to go next. Like, maneuver? And there was a water fountain. I'm like, oh, you guys want to drink some water? And then they looked at it... Like, what is this, mom? What are you showing us? Is this a pond? Is this for birds or what is it? And I was like, it's a water. And then I pushed it and they acted like, free water? What? It's not bottled? All of that? (laughs) And they just went to town. Now there's video, Luisito's licking the fucking whole shit. Jorjito, he's <laughs> fucking watering his nose. He's not even drinking it. <laughs> but it's just, it was their it? fucking first time discovering a fucking water fountain. <laughs> and to me, I'm thinking like we would get them at the park. Like this is our shit, right? And fuck it, dog. Just let them learn. That's a lot of progress. And that's amazing because imagine like 60 years ago, colored people like us couldn't even wow, drink out of water fountains. Fountain. Like us? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, come on, fool. You know you didn't get you what? Could, you could drink out of the water fountain. <laughs> <laughs> you could drink out of the water fountain. Brown people. Me, Letty, and Maximum were yeah. fucking thirsty. Yeah, we were so thirsty. Luisito out of luck. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Luisito super out of luck. Oh, super. Wow. Okay, guys. <laughs> Jorjito? Jorjito, yeah. Jorjito's right there with Vic. Luisito for Luisito. Yeah. 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 <laughs> He'll be an ass and be like, ha, this isn't for you. <laughs> nah, but yeah, nah, but also I think that's funny as fuck. I love yeah. that. I, I want your kids to like, remember when Diddy, um, when he t- took out a dollar and he like looked at it all confused, like it was a single the dollar bill? kid, yeah. I, that, I feel like that's how that's your kids are going to look at dollars. I, I, want, like, I wonder what else they're going to have like culture shock for. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, they were inside Disneyland. They were using their credit cards to buy their toys. That's like these so kids are popping out. Can they have a credit card? Yeah, they have their own little credit card, their little bank Damn. accounts and Let everything. Let me find out they have a better credit score than me. <laughs> Already, <laughs> look. That's the goal. You want you that for your house? kids, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Put that on me. Cosign for me. Yeah. yeah. Hey, hey, Orito, cosign for me. <laughs> don't tell your mom. <laughs> if we just reply, all right, don't fuck up my shit, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but shout out to them. And then, like, um, there was a, 
there was a janitor that DM'd me from, from Disney. No way. He's like, just so you know, we wash those every day. Like, literally, those uh, the, the water fountains are clean. Yeah, but you don't. But I'm like, I don't give a shit, dog. That that was how we live, dog. Like, I definitely yeah. get your fucking immunity fountain. up, dog. Yeah, like, to I used me, to drink I don't, out of the, the manguera. That, Facts. Mm. But I ain't gonna lie, the man, but I ain't gonna lie for the manguera is yours. The one that scored for like another 5,000 kids. Satanos. The kid used to be like, <laughs> and I come right behind him. <laughs> After running, sweating. Yeah, <laughs> um, we're, we're down bad, but yeah, that's bad. <laughs> Dude, the water was a highway. <laughs> Uh, oh, when it was hot? I don't know where, like, what the fuck? When it was low and you had to get super next to oh, the yeah. fucking you fierro. Know, super. <laughs> <laughs> suck it out. Yeah. Your mouth right next to the fierro. Oh, when that shit was hella low, you had to damn near. Oh, yeah, and then, and then, and then, and then, for, for when you in, oh my God, it used to be the worst, but yeah. when you and another kid get there at the same time and it's just a fucking yeah. much No, shit. my sister, she was drinking and a kid came behind her and she broke all her teeth because oh. she like went into the water fountain. That's like my yeah, worst Yeah, that shit's crazy. That was that some happens. shit right there, but That's yeah. fucked up. Shout out to the water fountain. Shout yeah, out to the kids. water fountain. Shout out to my little kids li living their fucking rich ass life. <laughs> Them little fools. In the that video's so funny. It's kind of like you turn around and you're like, ah. <laughs> yeah. Have a good time. Should we do sombra sala? That's amazing. Yeah. Sombra sala. Sombra sala. Sombra sala. Sombra sala. Burr, 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 burr. I'm sorry. And we are back. Oh my God, Angie. Okay. I know. I'm doing what they hate. Okay. Wash it down with the cheers. Cheers. She's no. eating a potato ball. Shots. I know the potatoes all over my mouth. Oh. Hey, yo. Cheers. Like, literally. Hey, yo. Hey, what are you drinking? Agua fresca. <sighs> Like your we are back with Sombra Sala, and just to conclude, while Angie eats potato, Shakira is cheap. Angie, can you please give us a little more details about what is going on with the Shakira story? Okay, so you guys know how PK and her split, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay, and so she has the pretty much the custody of the kids, and she's moving back to Miami. Miami, she's working, Miami. Working, all that stuff. You okay? The show's crazy. <sighs> you good, bestie? <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I tried it when I was throwing up last week. The, the thumb trick? Hey, I almost got some mm -hmm <laughs> off that post. I don't know if y'all seen that. You know, nobody seen that? You saw that? Wait, what was it? You didn't see that? When it just she posted girls that? down to do it. Yeah, some girl was like, sorry to interrupt. But so, some girl was like, I don't have a gag reflex. Like, just commented that. Yeah. And then uh, I was oh, like, I, I was like this. Like, I did this emoji. And then she was like, of course. <laughs> 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 <Have it come? laughs> <laughs> she was trying to beat your penis like I was in the water fountain. Uh. <laughs> okay, Shakira right, go, go, is cheap. Go, back to okay, Shakira. Shout out to the thumb trick dog. <laughs> so um, you guys know how Sh uh, Shakira and PK split, split whatever. Yeah. Yeah. And so now she has custody of the kids. She's moving back to Miami. Miami sorry, next year. And um, so she's actually looking for a nanny, like really looking for a nanny. And so there's a post saying that she's looking for the nanny. And she's only paying twenty four hundred a month to take care of two kids, and that'll pay like travel expenses. And you can live with her in the mansion, but it's like, what's wrong with that? What do you? You can live in the mansion. You can live with her, but mind you, you're gonna Rich, be that working. Is fucking... all, but you're gonna be working the whole time. How old are the kids? I think they're like seven and nine. That's, mm, seven and that's, that's good. good. I know. You get room and board. You live in a mansion. Yeah. Are you kidding? And you like okay, be around Shakira. My, it's Miami. Miami okay. is expensive. But she doesn't have to worry yeah, about she rent. she doesn't have to worry about rent. So she has, she wants to buy stuff. But okay, clearly she Miami? has someone, right? I, she has a, she has Not someone. yet. No, no, no. It just happened like, like three okay, days. But, but, but the fact that, the fuck? But the fact that, that Shakira is looking for this online, yeah. I don't think this is safe. I think it should be, I think it should come from recommendation yeah. or. And well, this is verified? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But she's only, there's only like, honestly, two requirements as, as, uh, as far as right now. And it's literally, she's like, I don't care what ethnicity, race, whatever, anything, background. As long as you don't have, like, any contact with the press and you're going to sign, like, an NDA. Mm. That's the only requirement she's having as of This right seems now. too, like, too much information to be public. There's yeah. a safer way to go about this. Yeah. I used to, uh, not to be an expert, but I used to date a girl that was a nanny for, like, rich people. And there was, like, a whole, like, program and, like, a... Uh, uh, 
it's almost like a, you sign up for something. You have to be vetted. Right. You go in, like, right. there's Services. a pool yeah, to choose from. Oh, yeah, from. yeah. There's, like, a website. Yeah, there's, like, like a website. Yeah, something, something like, like that, that where it's, like, you have to meet certain requirements. And then it's, like, they do interviews and all this stuff. And then you're around a bunch of, like, rich, famous kids. You make good money. Yeah. You know? But it More like it's a whole background sure. check and shit. Like Shakira should be going through that shit. Not yeah. not like posting on Instagram. Yeah, that's like, a little. Well, it wasn't weird. her Instagram. It was oh. this other guy that posted it for so her. Then, but that's uh, really what she's looking for. I, As of I now, I already don't trust it. It's someone else that's posting for her. Yeah. If you're already gonna have someone else post it, you're not gonna say that it's for Shakira. Like clearly, it's someone else posting so that it's not. They don't, don't know it's like, you. Like, Go ahead, go ahead, Do you get go what ahead. I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, if I'm already I, having Vic post for me because I don't want to post it on my own, mm -hmm. why would he say that it's for me? Because that's yeah. essentially doing the same thing. But but I'm, but I'm also assuming that the internet's doing its power where they see that this guy is probably really close to her yeah. and just like you know a lot of inside shit. Yeah. And yeah. she is and she is like in the in that like Latino world and and not to just exit the mob, but like the little European side where Ooh. she's dating like a soccer player and she's like was where dating was her. was dating married have kids baby daddy where they're like the talk of the town right now. Oh yeah. Like yeah. they're like oh oh my God the perfect girl and the perfect man got divorced and she's moving back to Miami and the kids need a nanny and yeah. and well that's pretty much what's happening yeah yeah because. yeah so, so that's why that's why I do believe the story but also oh, like Shakira don't like ask one of your other rich friends that you really trust yeah. and love to recommend the, the person they trust maybe like a tia that's done it for years yeah, that tia, no, like, cousin, but I think you're going family. about it because somebody genuine and but yes I understand why Shakira would want somebody to sign an NDA right and not because that makes sense. I, and, and, and that's very valid because you're at your home and you're yeah. You know, uh, I'm pretty sure scandal, Shakira wants yeah. to be able to scream at her kid and call him little shits without somebody going to the media and saying she's a bad mom. Mm -hmm. You yeah. get what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I just I don't think whatever the, that if that payment existed, that it would be bad. I think people would do it just to live there. Like, people would just be nannies just to live at that spot. I don't know. So to have that added How crazy income is the mansion, Jose? Can we, can, we, can we just look up yeah. Shakira mansion in, in Miami? Miami? But look, back to the price. I don't think the yeah. price is bad. It's not bad, especially with room and board. Because, yeah. look, okay, I, I'm not a believer in, like, just because somebody's rich, you have to, they have to pay top dollar. Yeah. Like, it's like that's a pro rate. Like, what's like, the rate at yeah, this occupation? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, it shouldn't matter how much money they have in their account or how much money they're worth or whatever. Mm -hmm. It's like, but this if is you, how A car much? wash is the same price if, but if you're, you're actually, five, a billionaire and if you're, if you're exactly. nine to five. I get what you're car saying, wash, though, but, it's a set but, but, yeah. but also, let's, let's, let's keep in mind that this lady... Is not gonna be a regular nanny, dog. She has to take two fame, two of the most famous people in the world's kids to school, yeah. feed them, make sure nothing like it's like it's like mm -hmm. you're you're also taking care of, and it, it sounds fucked up, but you're not taking care of regular. Kids. You think that all of these maids and nannies get paid a lot of money? They, they still, wouldn't be maids and nannies yeah. if they got paid a lot of money. They no. still take a shit. They still eat. It's the same shit, even no, if they're celebrities. Even if they're so, even if they're Jay Z and Beyonce's whatever, they're yeah. not getting paid a lot. I'm pretty sure Jay Z's nannies pretty, for yeah. Blue is getting nah, paid. Dog. No, that's I think I follow her on Twitter. No cap. The, that's the <laughs> thing, though. Like, if they the, did, they the wouldn't. Yeah, yeah. If they got paid a lot, they'll they quit. wouldn't be doing yeah. what they're doing. I don't, I don't know. know. I mean, okay. they'll get paid decent, but if like... Get paid decent. If we're talking They're going to get paid more than the... If we're talking the, the, numbers, yeah, I'm giving yeah, someone. Numbers and it's okay. She's So it's $2,400 yep. a month. That's four weeks. That's full-time 40 hours. That comes down to $15 an hour. Yes. That's not even minimum. But you live at the house. That's not even minimum. Ah, see, when you put it down like Thank that, no. that's fine. But you live at the crib, dog. No. Dog, you yeah. you work every and, day. That's and saying. that's if like you're doing full time. So it's like you're clocking in, you're clocking out, but this is salary, so it's like no. You live there. Yeah. Uh, you don't, don't pay for any out. utilities, any rent, any food. You True, live but you there. Buy stuff. No, you of that's course, yeah, but stuff, and I get that it. that's all price. No, that's that's taken out of the price. Thank that was you. probably negotiated. Like, hey, if you do, if you live here, this is what it's gonna be. If you don't live here, this is what it's gonna be. Okay, there's, what's there's a valley rate? Of perks too. What's a valley rate? I would, I would think like starting off in the twenties. Twenty thousand? No, twenty dollars an hour at minimum. Oh, that's good. Like, yeah. like if you pay me four bands a month, that's good. And I live yeah. with you. No, sorry. You don't even know, like, what if the nanny is cooking as well? That part I, I just can't wait to you guys are parents. Yeah, that's okay. Can't look, so, sure. so, okay, so I don't know anything about Shakira, but she's rich. I'm assuming. Yeah, yeah okay. So this is what I'm assuming. I'm assuming. Not they according have... to Spain. Doesn't she owe tax money? <laughs> oh, yeah, <that's> nice. <laughs> Look, I'm assuming that she has, like, a maid that cleans, mm -hmm. right? So she's not going to be, like, asked to clean. She probably has a chef, a private chef that cooks for them. Yeah. Right? Probably has a, 
like a um a landscaper or whatever like so she's solely asked to like pick Sit up the kids drop off make sure okay, they're good Vic. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Vic. Cause what's that, and that's why, Vic, going back harder? to my Cook, experience, Vic, what's harder? that's all she had to do. Okay, Vic, what's harder? Cooking or taking care of little Vic? Cooking. But he's a parent. No, that's what I'm asking you. What's harder, yeah. taking care of little Vic or cooking? Well, for me, <laughs> cooking. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, but like uh, in general, yeah, taking care of the kids. Okay. Yeah. Imagine they're not even your kids. You're new. You're coming to a whole new environment. Their mom is fucking stardom, dog. Yeah. 24, okay, if it's at least for four bands a month, it's fucking, like, reasonable. If it's four bands that's and she didn't cool. live at the crib, I get it. But you guys are underestimating living at the fucking crib. Because she also has a maid. She also has a chef. Like if she's, she's not, not they're not asking everything. her to do chores. And the only I don't know, we don't know that. We're we don't putting know. it all together. All that, yeah, of all course we don't. You only gave us the information of exactly. how she gets paid. But look, and, I, and I'm only referencing, yeah, look, I'm, I'm referencing my experience. Damn, I ain't like, gonna lie, 24 with this crib right here? What y'all got? Bro, that's Come what I'm on. saying. Bro, this girl that I used to date. The kids could drown there. Used to stop. She gotta be a And her only job is to make sure that they don't drown. They don't drown. That's it. Look, I'll tell you exactly what this girl's responsibilities were. She would drive to Bel Air early in the morning on the weekends, right? She would take him to the movies. She would take him to like Topanga Mall or mm -hmm. some shit. She would just take him to do fools, fun yeah. shit. She lived there with them? No, but she would sleep over on the weekends. Mm. Just the weekends, right? So she would do that. She would, they would have a chef. So she would just tell them what to make. Yeah. Basically ask the kids what they want or maybe tell them, okay, they should make this. And that's all, bro. She just had to take them to like school sometimes or drop them off with their friends. Like, it was not hard work. She would tell me, she was like, this shit is easy mm -hmm. as fuck. And no, I get paid this. And she gets paid. You know what I'm saying? How old so were like, the kids? They were like teenagers. I don't know how much exactly she got paid. Yeah. But, I mean, she was driving a Corolla. So let's be real. You know what I'm saying? Like, she yeah. was, you know, like, I'm sure she wasn't getting that lived six with us bands just, a month. And watched me and my sister. You had a nanny? Well, she, she was from El Salvador. She lived with us. Wow. Yeah. Oh, like she lived there, so the kind of trade was like, take yeah. care of the girl. That well, you yeah, can live that here. makes sense. That's life, dog. Like that that's, happens. That's like, a big mm. chunk of money that mom, like, you don't have to okay. pay for. So, example, my mom cleans houses. Mm -hmm. She was never like, oh, I'm a, I'm a nanny. But some of her jobs requirements were sometimes she would pick up. Um, but my mom also cleaned, washed, yeah. folded. Yeah. So shout out um, the lady that's very blessed in our hearts. You know, I'm, I don't want to say your name. I don't want to put out there, but. She's my mom still works for it to this day. That's awesome. And my mom gets paid more than she cares. But you always said she also did all that. But she also did all, but mm -hmm. but you know, it just I think it's different requirements. I could see I, I see both arguments, yeah. but but also I feel like when you're well, coming, if this is real, but also look, I don't, I don't know who that lady is, everywhere. but look, we all look at Shakira and she's an artist, so we assume she's a fucking billionaire and all this stuff. And that, but that look at how many she, people assume shit about you, dog. Look, yeah, and Already. look, that, that lady, I don't know who it is. It's you don't different. have to tell me who it is. She might be richer than Shakira. The daddy. The one that your mom works for. She no, might Shakira's be. richer. Okay, I don't know, but I'm but, saying like but she but might be like it's just low. It's just with the people with the just fame. love counting pockets and yes. being like this needs to be no, this and this I, that that. Yeah. Whatever they settled it, if they settled on something, okay. there's people for that. Okay, but you know your clientele. Let's just be honest. Like if like, cause I'm pretty sure the people that are gonna be recommended to her is people with experience that have worked. But they should be recommended. It shouldn't be a post. Yeah, no, I think yeah. no. Yeah. That, yeah. That, yeah. That, I think I think we all agree on that. I think yeah, yeah you're looking like online for that's just and, and, and and let's just be honest with Shakira's like where her status is like mm -hmm. it's very hard. I'm pretty sure she deals with a lot of trusting, especially with her kids. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And I don't know how the the agreement is with the fucking with the with the marriage and the divorce, but I'm pretty sure P fucking PK gotta agree on the nanny. Yeah. yeah. Well, especially if stayed, it involves the kids. PK stayed in Spain and she's moving back to Miami with the kids. And then PK can come and see the kids for um, 10 times a month. But the thing is that PK has to pay to get here. But then Shakira has to pay PK's ticket to go back. Oh, wow. So that's like the thing. Oh, that, rich shit. Yeah, that's like. The private know. jet. He's, okay. you know, he's going over know. there in the PK. Okay, so they're matching it. Yeah. 1200 each. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. PK and Shakira matching 1200. Yeah. Dog. That's not a lot. That's, That's not, not a lot. A lot. That's not dog. a lot. Yeah. But okay, also, you got to think. That's a little bit of money. They're putting that think, they're yeah. putting that number out there. Minimum. That's a Look, they're, uh, I don't trust this. That's what I want to try to pay for rent. It Look, says that a content creator is the one yeah, who leaked the alleged information. 
Content yeah. creators get it. Look, well, look, I, I'm, I get it. She's not saying it's 100% true, yeah. but this is talk of the town right now. Yeah, yeah. and it's everywhere. Okay, but let's just talk of the town. So talk look, so... T- that's why the starting that's why rate. Yeah, but if they lived at my crib, I wouldn't pay as much. Look, let him, let him, let him, let him hold you could very much afford these. Don't say that because then people are gonna assume, and then I'm gonna get a taco guy, and he's gonna charge me a billion dollars because yeah. oh my god, you have the money. Like nah, this shit is a set price for a set work. Come on. Oh, I'm over here fixing her hair. But I, I get, I, I get both sides. I definitely get both sides. Yeah. But I feel like if it's like a full like dog. Hey, so I think it's pays more for Botox than, than for the hair. <laughs> no, mom, I, I know how much the prices are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My mom will be telling me. Oh. Yeah, yeah. She, she could get tricky when it comes to shit like this. But this is a great summer. I thought one of my favorites. Yeah. There you go. We had us had us put this match in this nice dog. It is. It's like oh yeah, for sure. She has nice houses. Even mm-hmm. the one in um Spain. The one, the one in Spain is fire. And I think she has another one in Bahamas. Yeah. That's fine. I wish I was. That part. That's where she's living? Are the nannies living? Oh, I'll do it for free. Fuck it. <laughs> for free? Okay. Right. How much is a stepdad paying? That part. <laughs> you just got to live there. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. You don't got to pay me shit. You just got to twerk. <laughs> <laughs> With the fucking, what is it? Wagoneer. Wagoneer. <laughs> she buys you a Wagoneer and you stay there oh, forever? Oh, shit, I'm there. That's all you got to give me. <laughs> Say less. Enroll Vic in private school and we're good. That part. <laughs> Wagoneer right. and, and, and fucking round trips once a month to <laughs> Texas. Girl, <laughs> 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 I'm just this. <laughs> thumb guy. trick and her tongue trick. Remember oh, at yeah, the fucking. Yeah. Hips don't lie. Yo, shit, fuck it. Yeah, bro. They, un- she could lie to me all she wants as long as her hips don't. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie. Who's 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 somebody that you'll stay with even if they cheat on you? I'm gonna say Paloma, mommy. <laughs> Sounds like a porn star. It is, isn't it? No, no it's she's a, a singer. She's Chilean. Oh, you, oh. She's a Chilean singer. Only fans, it's different. <laughs> no, she's not only fans. She's a legitimate That's singer. That's what Josh Flo said. Who <laughs> could cheat on me, Carol G? I, you're such a liar because you're like, oh, Carol G and Becky G and Cheeky. See, I thought I. Man, I don't fuck that shit. What about you? What about you, Angie? Who could cheat oh, on you and you stay face? with him? What's his face? Um, Maluma. No, Angie. you know what? Maluma has been doing I'm a fear. Like, <laughs> what? Like, I'm a fear. That's a that's a group. <laughs> Wait, what's the group? Wait, what's the group? That that's called the train. Sorry. What's the group that you and Angie have a lot in life? And then I'm like, that's the group. So I'm just the group, but the rapper's name is Slug. Slug, yeah. yeah. Can you cheat on him? No, she wouldn't get with him. She no. doesn't like him for that. No. Okay. So a lot of yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Can you name one person that you yes, let you? Yes, but I'm horrible with names. What's his name? What about uh, oh, you? Aaron Diaz. That he can cheat on me all he wants. That's What's his name? Aaron Diaz. So he's who the a, fuck is this Aaron Diaz? I want to see him. I want to see him. Actor. He can cheat on me all he wants. I want to see him. By the way, if you're wondering who's eating, it's Vic. Just oh, yeah, I, I could just hear. This Aaron Diaz. First time ever. This dude is trash. Let me see. Oh my God, you're such a liar. The lights no, in the way. The lights in the way. He's such. Move the light real quick. Move the Have you ever seen classic? Move the light a little six? bit. Right there, right there, right there. I still I can't see. I literally still can't see. I'll show you on my phone. I'll show you right now on my phone. Can I see the light. Put the light back. Yeah, what's wrong with that fool? I could see Angie pulling up with him to Thanksgiving dinner. What's wrong with that? I found him. I found him. I got you. He's not a. He's not a bad looking guy. Yeah. Thank you, Vic. Thank you for being supportive. Angie, yeah. yes. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. yes. I've seen him in multiple novelas. Hey, you exactly. guys. Have you heard, have you seen Classic 406 before Rebelde? That was it. Oh, my God. You know, could cheat on me. You know, could cheat on me. And, 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 and fuck it. I apologize if that bitch cheats on me. <laughs> Who? Teresa. You know what I'm talking about? Ooh, the, yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my God. What's, what's her name, Angie? I don't know her name. But for, the, for the one that. Oh, know, my Teresa. God. This bitch could cheat yeah, on yeah. me all day. It's like me. No, she doesn't. Oh, I think her she name is it? Angelique something. <laughs> Let's insert a photo of her here. I like the Anai girl. Anai? Yeah. She's blonde. You know who I'm talking about. You guys, this girl right here could cheat on me. Even though she only dates super rich, white, old Type men. Type in Anai novelas. She dates Europeans? She, she dates Europeans, literally. Speaking of Europeans, Vic, how do you feel about Rosalia winning a Latin Grammy? Mm, great question. So... Oh. I'm oh, a um, bad buddy. That's what you look like? I like her. Oh, you like her? She, she, she was a rebelde. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see, I remember this mm, thing. Okay. So I looked up the um, the definition of like how to win a Latin Grammy. And it just has to be that like you have 51% of your lyrics be in Spanish. So it's not necessarily that you're like 
a Latin person. So it's the person. Hispanic Grammys. It should be mm -hmm. because by definition, it's like, yeah, like she's from Spain. She's not a Latina. But I did see somewhere. I didn't confirm it. I wanted to look deeper into it. Okay. But somebody said that she's of Cuban descent living and in was born Spain. in Spain. That kind of complicates things. But if that's the case, then it's like, okay, technically, yeah, she is Latina, just born in Spain the same way that, I don't know, like if Duno's kids are born in Spain. You know, it's like they're, they're Mexican. They're still Mexican. You know what I'm saying? I see what you're saying. Like, fuck, the bloodline is still yeah. Latino. Yeah, Latino. exactly. Or like we're born in America, but we're still Mexican. In Mexican. Us. Exactly, like yeah. So. No American so, in us. It's interesting, no. but I mean. Except when. Yeah, I feel like. a white girl. Yeah, I feel like it's like, ah, like it's, it's, it's such a gray area, but I mean. How mad were people about this? People are always mad about her success. Yeah, people are. For, for, because she did start out music like the. Flamenco, like the yeah. Spain shit. Yeah, That's yeah, how yeah. she really started. That's some Spain music. Then it was like mm -hmm. reggaeton and all that shit got popping. And then she and transitioned she, into that. But she just happens to be so fucking good at it. Like, let's be real. You know what I'm saying? And like, she composes. And yeah, like she's talented. She's talented. You know what I'm saying? But she does is chew gum good. <laughs> and make faces. Yeah. You guys, are, she does good at you that guys are honestly Rosalia fans. Like, um, you'll tell me name like, oh one song. I can't name you one uh, song. It's called Linda. Go. Go. Okay, okay, that's Hold my on, let, problem. Let me go, let me yeah. go, let it go. How does it go? Yeah, Angie, get in your fucking zone, Angie, talk your shit. Go, Vic. The song? Um, <laughs> so he knows the no, title. No, but somos, pero somos homies. It's like some shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's her and Tokisha no, right, going back right. and forth. You know what but I'm talking about? Yeah. because you like Tokisha. That's, that's because why. I like that song. Otherwise, because they have a, was... because um, Rosalia and... Tokisha have another song that's like uh, that's her song that's uh, that. Rosalia song. <laughs> yeah, they have another song and <laughs> yeah. it's like it's Rosalia's style and Something that shit is Versace. trash. Yeah, yeah, that shit yeah, is yeah, trash. Yeah, yeah. I don't it like it. But, but, yeah, that shit is trash. Which I like that song, but my problem with Rosalia, I like Rosalia, but not as much. Why? Because she doesn't have real singles by herself unless she has a feature. Mm. Why did we start listening to her? She's uh, like, uh, what was it? What was J, J Balvin? Oh, no. J Balvin. But what's it called? Con Altura. Con Altura. Okay, who's the Rosalia of hip hop? Rosalia's fire, guys. The I would not pay to go watch her. Sorry. So also, that's a great question. The Rosalia of hip hop would be like okay, the person that you only pay attention to if they had a Lady, who's the Rosalia of hip hop? I'm talking to, I'm let Vic talk. Yeah. No, I'm listening. No, I'm, yeah. I'm kind of curious too. I, I'm, I'm thinking. You gotta understand, right? Yeah. In in Rosalia created a different style of genre mm -hmm. for what is mainstream music. There was never a a, a flamenco Spain influenced mute like popular artist. Yeah, you're and right. She was the one. Yeah. And not even just hey, that. Hey, hey, Enrique see... Iglesias exists, dog. He's Spaniard. But that, was... that's pop. Yeah. And he'll sing and then in different when languages. You actually look at Rosalia's visuals. Mm -hmm. She was ahead of her time. I respect her that. old, like, Malamente and all that stuff. Like, but I think when Angie... Wow, the hidden Rosalia fan comes yeah. out. Yeah, Rosalia oh, hive over here. I think, I think, I think... I love music in general. First yeah. of all, you're a Clipper fan. Second of all, <laughs> you, you fucking... I you like the Packers. So I don't I know, like bro. like the I'm a Raider fan, dog. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> I think, I think, I think, I think Angie's point is that we only know her... Dude, fuck Angie already. I think Angie. Shut up, Angie. <laughs> fucking understand I Angie. Music. I love Bad Bunny's album. I, I just thought it great... Win. Yeah, I think that was a snub. Her great-grandfather was Cuban. Oh, okay. Well, that's, that's Your really... Your great-grandfather was Spaniard. That's really far. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's actually really far. Oh, fuck. Thanks for pulling that up. Yeah, yeah that's... Pardon myself. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I tried to grab the balloon and was bugging me. Oh, yeah, that's what you saw me? I was like, oh, shit. Okay, yeah. Her great, grand, her great paternal grandfather was Cuban. Not uh, us breaking up over it. Was, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, ah. Okay, but my thing is, if we're going to talk Angie smack sweats. about Rosalia, then it's going to be trash. Not trash, Make but also talk about his the. His face, she Jay, what, I can't. I don't have headphones. I don't know what you're talking. I don't know if you're talk. saying something bad. No, talk. Um, Jay Balvin winning the Afro Latino Award and he accepting it. So that should oh, also that. be thanked. Okay. Wait, did that happen again? No, okay. but it happened. Oh, it happened and then it's last like, okay. year or whatever. Yeah. Well, that's a pass. Hey, dog, finish okay. you you your bash? damn cheese ball or whatever it is. Like, I, <laughs> okay, I want to say this. I, I fuck with the Latin Grammys, even though they don't fuck with me yet. But, like, I, I like the concept of, like, giving, you know, Latin nice. artists, like, their their flowers and their acceptance. But I, I don't like feeling like it's a secondary tier. It's not. We think that because... We're in America. No, but because, look, 
the, the reason I'm saying that is because <laughs> Bad Bunny, like, yeah, he's gonna win a Grammy too. Bad Bunny's he, gonna win album of the year. He should. He has to. If he, if he, he has to. If he has to. If he doesn't, like, it's a robbery. Adele didn't do better. Robbery. Beyonce didn't do better. Yeah. And that's what Drake I'm saying. Didn't Drake didn't do better. Drake and, and, I, no. and I hope that like because he got left out of a lot of categories. That he no, should. No, he's in the main. He's he's in the ones he should be in. He's he in album swept. of the year. He's in a lot of the melodic shit. I don't think he got like like a single of the year. He shouldn't be like the like I know like Kendrick like got as many nominations like a lot. But he's also in the Spanish category of nominations. Like we yeah, can't yeah. put him in rap category. Because yeah, fact. Sure but but I know, okay. But but let's just be honest. If he doesn't win, oh, the, he needs to win. They, they don't fuck with us. Grammys is over if he doesn't he win. Yeah. win. He Rosalia won. No, no we're talking about the real Grammy. Like, oh, no, I'm, see what you're doing. I know, I know. Yeah. I did that. I know. I did we're that. We're talking about the real <laughs> Grammy. That was wrong of me. As soon as I said it, I'm like, no, I shouldn't have said that. Whoa. But I don't want to feel a like shot. that. Clip, take a shot. Fucking colonizer. Take a shot. Clip. Take a shot. We're making that a clip. Take a shot. Jose, Look, it's a clip. Take a shot. Take a shot. You're so take her. Come on, oh, Bessie. Go, go take a shot. Come right, on, right. Bessie. That convinced him. Come I'm on, like, you got this. I'm sad that I'm not invited to either Grammys, honestly. <laughs> you for sure come. never invited to the Latin Grammys now. I don't know. I've been to the Grammys before. So I can't. Is it overrated? <laughs> no, it's the, it's rated. It's it's, <laughs> it's rated. Well, thanks for making me feel better. <laughs> Where's you going? Okay. Nice. It oh. was it was, it was sad. It was the day oh. that Kobe died. Oh. Yeah. That was the worst. That was the worst day. shit ever, dog. Damn. So you really didn't get in, Joe. Like, no, it was fucking crazy because they were doing a uh, tribute for, to for Nipsey. Nip. Yeah, Nip. And then remember they added the Kobe photo. Yeah, at last minute. And I had I was there for the rehearsal, so the rehearsals is a photo of Nip. And it's crazy to see when it hit the Grammys, they had added the Kobe <sighs> photo. It's like shit. I'll never forget that day. That shit was crazy. Can we put a little picture of Letty at the Grammys. Hold it. Can we? Um, I'll put a photo here. He was looking fly. Shout out to us. What'd I was wear? looking fly. Never forget Vic said the Lion Grammys are. Wow. Oh, man, I just said that it's not. All right, but yeah, he's going to win be. the Grammy album of the he year. He has to. At he the has Grammys. to. He has to. There's no other right answer. There's only one right answer. Yeah. It's fucking Bad Bunny. Lie, I ain't going to lie. Shout out Bad Bunny because he probably just thinks he's doing music, but dog is, he's breaking so many barriers. Yeah, for yeah he is. At, at the highest level, and he shows love to everybody coming up. Yeah. Like, like I seen a picture of I seen that for bring out Angel Dior at his concert, make songs with Raúl, make work with all these upcoming producers and all this shit. Shout out him. All right, salute. <laughs> <laughs> I've been drinking the most. You have not actually. Yes, I have. Vic drank more than anybody. Run it back. Yeah, low key. Run it back. I'm a tank. <laughs> this part is all over, but Andy, I like cheers. it. We followed the thing, but we also got no dark, brown back shout outs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You have cheers. Oh, yeah, I think you're the only one that had one. I didn't have one. I have one. Okay, I shout out really to Hold on, let me finish. The bottle. Shout out to Gisela. Um, Gisela. Gisela. Um, yeah. She ran up on me at Sprouts Um, while I was in the, the meat aisle pause. Oh. I was buying some steak, and then she pulled up and she was like, oh my God. Are you Rosecrans Vic? And I was just like, yeah. And then she was like, oh, sorry. Oh, no, go for it if you're sorry. Um, <laughs> and then she was like, she was like, yeah. She's well, no, like, you're not I'm literally friend. listening to you right now. And then she showed me her phone and she's listening to Brown Bag. And that show was fire. Anyway, <laughs> what's so yeah, shout out to Gisela. Um, she gave me a discount of Sprout. She said, anytime I go there, I'm good. I'm certified. I get a discount. So shout out to her. She said also that her 12 year old son listens to us. Which made me want to change the subject about the things we talk about, the like content. What? I'm like, damn, we're, like 12 year olds are listening to us? Like, yeah, you're the one that's always, Horniado. Am I? All the time. Is it me? Horniado. <laughs> Is it really me? No, but yeah, shout out to Gisela and her son. Um, shout out to Sprouts, too. Yeah. Oh, and then shout out to the dude at La Cita that just like randomly walked up to me like super fast and he was like, what's up, fool? And then he just walked by, like yeah. Know. He was just like we get those a lot, yeah. a lot of the brown bag, and then that's yeah. it. Yeah. Oh we yeah. Don't somebody even get the name or anything. Yeah. Same thing at um, Complex Con. I was like walking over the bridge, and then some dude was like brown bag, and then but it was like such a fast exchange where I couldn't, you know. Oh, shout out to the guy that made a reel about us where he was wa he was listening to the pod, and then it was like where hey you guys how did we get so horny and then that so an old man was oh, like yeah. qué dijo <laughs> <laughs> shout out to that guy that made a fucking oh, yeah. deal about us that was I really fucking yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah they tagged us we I'm, we got to share that yeah that was pretty fire shout out to that fool um and then I went to uh I also oh, here I went to uh 
Disneyland? No, no, no. A car wash. And it was a car wash slash pupuseria in El Sereno. And it's called like exclusive exclusive car wash or something. Mm -hmm. um, but it was really fucking dope. And their listeners, this one dude named Henry, who's like part of the crew, he was telling me to tell Duno that he says brother because of you, that he tells he calls all of them brother. And I didn't know that you said brother that much until he mentioned that. And I was like, yeah, Duno does say brother. But he said he can't wait to come to the live show because he wants a brown bag baddie. Uh. Like, he was super cool. He knew all of like our lingo. And the guy that made that whole car wash, his name was Alan. So Alan is the one that does the car wash and the pupuseria is his wife, Sylvia. I think this is so dope. So somehow he knew about this lot. The car wash owner was about to sell it. So he sold his lowrider to put down on this space so that he can have the car wash. And now the car wash is booming next door. They have like where they build low riders. He, he showed me that area and there's a bunch of low lows. And I just thought it was so cool that when you bet on yourself, and that's a sacrifice. He's like, my wife thought, like, dude, why are you selling the low rider? We could use this money, this, that, and the third. But he used it, and now they have this big ass shit in El Sereno. So, I build low riders, that's car wash, and a pupuseria? It's a car wash slash pupuseria. Next door is they build low riders. Next, next door to that is a chop shop. Like, it's been <laughs> that booming because of that. Like, that's right. fucking dope. So, so, shout out to Alan. Fans, they love us, all that good shit. So I'm gonna yeah. put up to get my car wash there. That's right. No, their car wash is legit too. And then you can just have, have some fucking pupusas on the side. Yeah, and then the best. some little sorry baddies that right part. there. You know what I mean? Yeah, they're fucking dope. Bada bing, bada boom. So that's my brown bag shout out. And you have to go in and call him brother. Oh brother. Hey brother. Listen, brother. And did you have any brown bag shout outs? Do people recognize you? I did and I was drunk, but it was my friend's wedding. And the security guard actually did, and I forgot her name. I'm so sorry. It was a girl security. Shout it was out to a the girl security, security and she and I have a picture of Shout like to her step. company. She's like, next time you guys have an event, hire us. Her um, her boyfriend is the one that um, has owns the company and she works for. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. I'm sorry, I forgot her name. Are you guys kind of drunk. I'm so drunk. I'm pretty lit. Mm. Fuck. I'm. I'm See you guys December 23rd. Happy Thanksgiving, motherfuckers. It's Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Well, Episode 70. We'll be back, I think. Woo. Something. <laughs> <laughs> what episode is it? Is it 72 or 73? 73. 73. Okay, that's what I thought. 73. Episode Fuck Our Families. 